Eve today, okay? We got a giant watermelon here, so y'all know something coming, okay? We doing some stuff in a watermelon. That's not giant, that's pretty small. Okay, it's a mini size watermelon, okay? All right, <laughs> sorry, okay? Excuse me, okay? Guys you tend- seen a watermelon before? Guys tend to exaggerate with size, you know? Oh, I'm huge, okay, Sky, that's it? That's it, okay? I have to pitch it, you know? I pitch it. <laughs> Sometimes they're like, you know what? I ain't gonna do it on, you know, I'll give you a chance, you know what I mean? Okay? Three don't really do much for me, but whatever. Okay, anyway, anyway, homeboy, we are, did you understand that three? Three inches, three never mind. Inches. Okay, look here. Shh, don't tell people though. It's between us. Okay, guys, so we have this mini watermelon, okay? And I realized two black people standing here with a watermelon is probably not a good look, okay? But let's it's make this work. a great look. look. Really? We love watermelon. <laughs> <laughs> Put that on your next watermelon campaign ad. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Bet you we sell millions. Damn. We can get kicked of the culture for this one. All right, homeboy. <laughs> How you all doing, man? Is everybody here? Okay. Shayla's looking radiant Hi, today. Hi, silly moonshine. Thank you. By the way, Stephanie. Shayla's dad apparently is watching the show, so I can't talk too much shit, okay? I don't you know think what I mean? Here yet, I'm so. just saying, I can't, I can't talk too much, okay? <laughs> apparently, they look alike too. <laughs> just the bottom half of my face. Really? The top half, I look like my mama. Okay. Mm -hmm. True. Which side is prettier? I think my whole face is pretty cute, but I mean... I know, but it's con it's conflicting, you see? There's a lot of conflicting. So there's like the, there's, there's the dimple. Who that from, your dad? Mm-hmm. You got dimples? Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. You know what they say about dudes with dimples? They lie a lot. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, dad. That's I'm kidding. Thing? No, I just made that up. <laughs> sound real, though, right? It does kind of sound. Like okay. Okay. Everybody, Sashi is here. Everybody here. Okay. Okay. Hi, Darth Bane. Hi, Henry. All right. Hi, Darth. <laughs> So I grab my watermelon here, okay, and I get a little spike. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see that? That was sexy, right? Does that do anything? To I, I, I don't, I don't know, but I mean, some girls loosen up the juices. Some girls and they're looking and going, okay, all right, Sky, you go ahead, spike it again. <laughs> Short, quick strokes, homeboy. Okay, all right, not doing too much damage. That was stiff. <laughs> he said, "I'm sorry, Shayla. How do you do You're it?" Supposed to, you know. Put some. Do people like put that? Put some flicking at wrist. Do people like that? I think so. I don't know. I mean, I'm not gonna speak for other people. Okay, but you like it. I don't like to be spanked. I don't like pain. Okay, cool. I don't like pain, y'all. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. Not into it. Sorry. Okay. Sorry, sure, not sorry. Sure. Though I do like hot sauce. The fuck? So I guess everyone likes I'm their so own <laughs> version of pain. Sorry. Okay. So hold your boyfriend walking with a bottle of hot sauce and just pour it all over. Oh, look at me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Come on, girl. Come lick this shit. Ooh. That'd be hot. This is fire. That'd be hot. Oh, God. I got sriracha in my crack. Oh, God. Oh, boy. That sriracha probably burned the back of your nuts, you know. Anyway, look here. Okay. Okay. Enough with the sriracha sex, guys. Okay. This show is chaos. Okay. Okay. Dad, she brought that shit up. All right. Now, homeboy, we got to <laughs> we gotta make a little incision here, right? So if you are looking at this close up, what I'm trying to do here is make a mark. Where I could get my drill in there, okay? You see that? So I'm, I'm cutting in. Not actually cutting in. I'm just creating a line so that I know, okay, that is what I have to cut out, all right? Now I get a smaller knife. <clears throat> yeah, something like this, all right? Where I come in and I work my way around that circle. Right through the grooves, okay? Mm -hmm. Nice. Deutschland. All right, German, Germany in the house, homeboy. Germany is here. Okay, we got a strong German contingent. Look wow. at that. Look Can at I that. eat this? Well, I was going to eat it, but okay, you could eat it there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, Thank Sheila, you. plug that in for me. Use the extension, though, because we, we can need some length on it. Yeah. yeah. Watch out. So, plug that piece in. All right, guys. All right. Hey, Tanisha. Hey, Siddharth. Hey, Sam. Everybody hey, here. Everybody Thank here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hey, Jack. Hey, Iron Fan. Uh-huh. All right. So now, okay. Kind of could fit in. Kind of. Maybe a little bit more. Maybe a little bit more. 
Sadar says knife skin is better than P. Diddy. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that his son is like probably going to go to jail now too or something? I mean, his son charged, but getting charged does not mean you're going to jail. Oh, okay. Especially with people who have money. Okay. Because okay? their lawyer is going to be unbelievable. And then also, did he... But his son is being accused of sexual assault as well. Mm -hmm. Which is crazy. Hey, Manny. Did he, did he, like I said, did he ain't get where he is? Being no joker. So there will be people who will be played off, paid off. There's going to be people who, who don't remember. There's going to be people who disappear, okay? So, you know, that's just something to bear in mind. Okay, guys, you notice I just pushed that in now, okay? So I got the perfect size now. And now I hit this. Is that plugged in? Oh, not turned on. Hey, Shayla. So I'm blending. Oh, Lord. Hello, Denmark. Welcome. Lots of Europeans here today. What's up, Europe? Hey, Europe. Europe. Hello, Europe. <laughs> That's England. I mean, that is Europe too, but... Not in a union anymore. Yeah, they're not in the union. They're a part of the European Union now. Brexit, homeboy. Hi, Jack. Hi, Crystal. Hi, Iron Fan. Wow, you are really getting it. Oh, boy, this is what I do. You are getting it. Wow. I can safely say no. How fun. No bartender been inside a watermelon as much as me. Hi, Purple Head. Hi, Todrick. Todrick Hawk. Hey, One Power, welcome. Thanks for watching. What up, home boy? The UK in the house, Warwick. Bonjour. <laughs> Why is he doing it so slow? Because I'm I trying to get the chunks off the side, you see? So I'm using this to scrape and blend at the same time. So this metal spikes on the side here, not spikes, but I'm using it to rip that off as I blend, you see? Hi, Norway. Oh, we got our first super chat. Who's that? Who that? Who that? King Steph. What's up? What's up, this? Aw, welcome, welcome, welcome. Thanks for the donation, homeboy. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, all your money is going to buy booze. Hey, Big Mix. Old Lady Gaming in the house. Old Lady Gaming, that was a badass shot we came up with yesterday, based on her suggestion. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, now here's the thing with this, okay? Hello, we, Dr. Strong. We have to make space. What's up, Doc? Hey, Strong. The Doc's in the house. Okay, we have to make a little bit of space, okay, guys? So, here's how I can make my space. Actually, let's get a measuring cup. Grab a measuring cup for me, please. Just one of the small ones. All right. It's probably going to spill everywhere, but whatever. Oh, wow. You did so good, Sky. Hmm? I'm actually shocked. Dude, you ever watch fucking Tipsy Bartender before? Stop <laughs> asking me dumb shit. You know how many watermelons you didn't see me <laughs> work with? You did so good. I'm just giving you your, your flowers, that's all. Okay, okay. Thank you. All right? Now. All right. So, guys. Now, let us begin by getting some booze in there, okay? Mm. We can pour, we can pour. Okay, so I you pour. You know what goes really good wa with watermelon as well? What? Mezcal. We ain't put no mezcal in here. Okay. But that's a good try though. <laughs> Any other suggestions you want? Maybe you want some what? Cornflakes in there? What do you want in there? No, cornflakes. Arkansas's in the house. What's up, hey, Arkansas? Hey, Arkansas. Hey, Arkansas. Hey, Arkansas. Hey, Arkansas. Okay, guys, if you look in, because you can look inside there, okay? You can see inside the hole, mm. right? So I poured okay. some out. I can pour back in once we finish adding our booze. Nice. So the goal right now is we can go in with tequila. We can make this more margarita-ish, okay? So we're going in with tequila, triple sec, lime juice, maybe coconut. Unless you want to try something different. Unless you all go in a different direction. Any suggestions? Okay, we're opening the floor, homeboy, okay? We Just could don't suggest mezcal, apparently. Yeah, yeah, no mezcal, okay? You Thank and you your mezcal. super sticker. Thank you, thank you, thank you, man. We get 800 yen. That's yen, right? You're my number one, too. Thank you very much. Any suggestions, homeboy? Huh? Any suggestions? Who are you looking Yo, at? Yo, Big Mix, welcome. Greetings. What's up? What's a Big Mix 75? Hey, Big Hello Mix. from Indiana. Any suggestions on the liquor that we can use as the base? 
Come we could, on, y'all. We could do, we could do, um, we could do tequila. Oh, we could do gorgeous. vodka. Or we could do like, we could even do like Rum. a, we could do a water. Hey, Can we do a cognac though? Nah. No. Anyway, let's just go tequila. You all taking too long, all right? Sheila. Y'all sleeping in comments? Hit us with the tequila, okay? Put the inside the, inside yeah. the hole? Uh, yeah, yeah, where you want to put it on the floor? Just give it one more sec. Okay, okay one more sec, Tequi- one more sec. Tequila. Okay, some, one tequila. more sec. Someone okay. said tequila, okay? All right? The, the comments are a little bit behind. Yeah, the people. comments are a little behind. Someone Ew. said wrong. Somebody said crown apple. You what can make it work. Wrong with you? you can make crown apple. Water Paco. Water. Keep the Malibu. Wild, Wild Turkey. Turkey 101. Tequila. Gin. Tequila. Okay, gin. So far, tequila is winning. Yeah. Hello, all. Okay, hey, tequila. Hey, okay, man. okay. You know what? We're going with tequila. Tequila okay. it yeah, is. Yeah, tequila it is. Okay. okay. Steven. Tequila it is. And guys, we have salsa. Those of you who aren't familiar with this brand, it's very expensive. This was uh, $200 a bottle. Okay. But I know someone. I got it for under 10 Okay. <laughs> tequila. Pour. One, two, three, four. More, 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 more. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay. That's, that's better. Okay. So we got hey, tequila in there. Thanks for joining. Now we're coming behind that tequila homeboy with a little bit of this. Triple sec. Triple sec is an orange liqueur, guys. It usually goes hand in hand with tequila. Pour! One, two, three. Hello, four. Indonesia. Uh-huh. Five, six. No, no, no. That's good. That's good. Hello, That's Austin, good. Good. Texas, South Africa. People from everywhere watching. What's up? What's up, South Africa? Hey, South Africa. <laughs> What's up, Austin, Texas? Okay, now someone How says someone says the Kappa XO. I have a bottle of that downstairs, by the way. The kappa. That's very specific. I got to drink that at some point. Okay, now, next up, we can add a little flavoring to this margarita, right? Um, and so, the thought is, you could go different directions. You could go Malibu, which is a coconut rum or co- coconut liqueur, depending on how you look at it. Or you could even go in a more melon, melon Ooh, direction. Ooh, y'all. Okay. Or we could do a little combination. Let's do a little combination. A little bit of each, Okay. Do they go together? Who knows? All right. So let us begin. Coconut rum. Pour. Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. We ain't getting heavy. This is small. This is small vessel anyway. Come behind that. It's a melon liqueur. Give it a little pour. Okay, that's good. Yeah. We can keep this one light. Now, homeboy. Because of our tequilaism with this, okay? Because it's kind of you know there's margarita it's margarita-ish we can come in with a little squeeze of lime okay so we have a half of a lime in there squeeze that in please thank you henry we Ooh, that it. was a lot of juice in there okay good 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 okay. that's fine just give it to me okay before you mess up the house okay <laughs> <laughs> nothing but net homie nothing but net okay so now I come in back in here. Ooh. We just do a little bit more. Blending. Somebody said Midori can be a cute girl's name. I agree. I think so too, Jack. I know a lot of girls named Midori. They, do you? Yep. They all work at places where they have a pole in the center and they ride the pole. Okay. <laughs> Usually in a bikini. Okay. That's Midori's future. All right. <laughs> so yes, please do name your daughter Midori. Okay. I know a girl named Margarita. That ain't Midori. I know, but her name is Margarita. <laughs> I tell you right now, if your daughter named Mar- if your daughter named Midori, Cadillac. <laughs> Who's gonna name their Destiny, child? Destiny, Champagne. What's wrong with Destiny? Uh, Destiny's usually a stripper too. Champagne. Okay. What about Princess? I know, but Princess Furiosa. Okay. Furiosa is wild. <laughs> Furiosa. Okay. <laughs> Khaleesi. Khaleesi is pretty name. Dothraki, okay. Okay, here we go. Jon Snow, badass. Oh, we got Jon Snow news, by the way. Jon Snow news. Jon Snow is in the news. HBO was about to do a spinoff of, of um, you, okay, well, you know. Game of Thrones, they already did one. House of Dragons. House of Dragons, yes. Do you think House of Dragons is good? I liked it. I didn't I, think it was as good as Game of Thrones, but I liked it. it. Yeah, I didn't think it was good as Game of Thrones either, but the problem is, after what they did to us at the end of Game of Thrones, I'm a little sensitive about trying to get in too deep on House of Dragons. But there was supposed to be a legit Jon John Snow spinoff with my boy here. I okay. think his name is Kit, right? What is his name? Is something Kit? Kit. Kit Harrington. Yeah. yeah. 
By the way, he showed up at Barney's one night in the beginning. No way. When Game of Thrones was just starting, he was staying next to our Polly house. You know? And he was he was cool. I was talking to shit, right? I missed him. But I ain't like truly befriend him. You know, I ain't know he's gonna be that biggest star. I would have been like, hey, you know, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But that he was, was before I moved to LA. He was cool. He was in there having a couple of drinks. This was during the first season. Mm -hmm. Before the shit really took off, you know. So I watched it from the first season. Yeah. Me too, but I saw, and I, then I saw how popular it got. But this was a couple of episodes in when he was there, you know? Nice. So so anyway, so guys, let's get one more little blend in here. All right, all right. Got to drain it on the side. What's that? You know nothing. Nothing's John. What's up, Mirage? <laughs> you really tickled Stefan. It's, you, know what, you, know what, you know what's so crazy? Game of Thrones was such a big part of the culture, it but was. the final season was so bad. Why did they do us like that? No one even talks about it anymore. No one even talks about it anymore. The writers literally just gave up. Like, it was so disappointing. And I dedicated years of my life. Ten fucking years! <laughs> there, were, there were times we had to wait two years on an episode. You remember that shit? Yes. Dude, Sunday night, I remember it was The Walking Dead and Game of Thrones. You know what I mean? That was it. And then these dudes just watch. Oh, my God. Guys, I, all of us need therapy, okay? <laughs> I needed therapy. And guess what? Three body pro the Three Body Problem on Netflix is the same producers as Game of Thrones. I didn't see Three Body Problem. Yeah, I mean, hey, you know, based on what they did with Game of Thrones, you probably shouldn't see it. Okay, coming in, all right? Now, homeboy, there you have it, okay? What do you call this? I guess call it this, uh, but this is a mini watermelon, so let's just call this a mini watermelon margarita because it's kind of margarita-ish. Okay, I ain't cool. sure. Take a little sip. You can taste mostly watermelon with some maybe tequila oh, flavoring. We put, some te we put a lot of tequila in there. I don't, know, I don't know, but I mean a lot of watermelon in there too. Hey, so Eddie. Who knows? Thanks for tuning oh, in. Oh, it's actually like the perfect um, blend. You like yeah, it? Yeah. It's really well balanced. Yeah. You don't want, guys, I know it's a watermelon. You don't want to stack it with booze though. Don't, don't, don't kill it, okay? Don't think you're out here trying to prove something. You think it's cool? Yeah. Now, the, now, now the thing I would with, drink. I would take this home and drink it. Yeah. Yeah. It's fun, and we have we have a little bit more left over. You could do something with that. Like what? I don't know. I mean, if you don't know what this is, and you saw this, something would you drink it? You'll be like, ooh. I mean, clearly it's watermelon juice. Something with mezcal. Ooh. Oh, actually, huh? Something with mezcal. No liquor in this, right? So this is good for me. There you go. Mm -hmm. You don't need all that sugar. Ah. Someone Fuck. is asking, do you have to grope the melon like that before you You sure drink it? do, Mary, Mary. Yeah, homeboy, don't just grope it. Spike it, okay? Spike that shit. You gotta show it some love. Okay? Spike that. Watermelon is not the worst fruit, you silly goose. <laughs> 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 Who called watermelon the worst fruit? The worst, the worst fruit is like honeydew melon and fucking <laughs> that green melon that's all slimy and shit. What green melon that's all slimy? You know when you buy the, the, what is it called? Honeydew. Yeah, honeydew. Honey, honey, honeydew is orange. Honeydew ain't slimy. Oh, yeah, but like the, the other, uh, what is the other one called? It comes in the pack of the mixed fruit from the grocery store and I always avoid, yeah, whatever it's called. Honey, I don't fucking know the no, name of it. No, honeydew is not orange. Honey, uh, cantaloupe is orange. Cantaloupe. Cantaloupe and honeydew are both trash. What? Trash. Oh my God. Absolute trash. Absolutely not. So guys, Shayla worked out this morning. First, you tell them the dumb shit you did today. Actually, I'm sure it's dumb. Okay? I almost gave myself a, a legit heart attack today, y'all. Like, for real. Like, my heart was pounding out of my chest. And I thought for, like, maybe half a second that I might have to go to the hospital. Really? It was that bad? <laughs> yes. Because I woke up, and the first thing I did when I woke up is drank a Celsius. Do they have more? Don't ever do that unless you want to die. And they then I went to the gym right after I drank the Celsius because I was like, okay, this is going to be my pre-workout. And I started working out and then my heart started going like this. And I said, I was at the gym like, I need to sit down. <laughs> Does the Celsius have more, more um, caffeine than a Red Bull? Absolutely. It has 200 milligrams of caffeine. But doesn't, isn't Red Bull like that too? Uh, I don't know. I, know. I feel a Celsius. I don't feel a Red Bull when I drink it. Okay, hold tight. But then I was just like... How much caffeine in a Red Bull? How much caffeine in a Red Bull? And it made me feel sick for like four hours. Well, Red Bull has 101, yeah. 111 milligrams. And Almost so, twice as much. And Celsius has 200? Jesus Christ. 
So, t what was this again for the people? Okay, so this this is a what would you call this? A margarita punch, almost. Yeah, margarita it's kind of watermelon. Yeah, margarita watermelon punch. You know, blended in. Okay, so we're using this as a container. One of the things with watermelons that you guys should know is that watermelon is one of the few fruits that you could add shit to and it would hold it, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So you cut it open and you could put vodka in here, you could put vodka bottles and all that will just run in and infuse. So it could it could hold more than it comes with, you know? Probably also do it with a cantaloupe and a, and a honeydew melon. They're not gonna work the same. Oh, okay. Shit's gonna leak out, yeah. This, this, is, this is waterproof right here, okay? Okay, this built for drinking. This Watermelon is, is waterproof. This is the only one I've had great success with. Okay, but Shayla, don't just end your gym story there, homeboy. Tell them the details. So you go to the gym and... That's it. That's not it. I mean, I also saw my gym crush there, but that's nothing new. We usually go to the gym around the same time. So are you all talking? I mean... Oh, wait, hold on, <laughs> you all smashing? No, but like, I have a, I have a huge crush on this guy. This guy always has to put me on blast. I've had a crush on him for a very, 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 like, years. Is he rich? Years and years, yeah. Yeah, and he doesn't skip a leg day, so. He has legs, too? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, 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 he's pretty hot, so. So, you mentioned some, but you're here. He touched your hair? So, yeah, so whenever I see him at the gym, we don't, like, take time to chat with each other because we're working out, you know? So, we usually do, like, the little head nod thing or, like, a little wave, but today I was... We were walking in the same direction and he was behind me and I had a low ponytail and he grabbed my ponytail like that. Oh shit. <laughs> violence. My well, boy chose violence. So he pulled a little ponytail. He pulled my little ponytail. That's very sexual. Dad, you listen to the shit? <laughs> Your daughter about to get smashed. Okay. Stop. Sorry. No, she's not gonna give it up. She's not like that. Okay, so hold on. He pulled a little ponytail. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's it. That was that was the exchange. Are you all meeting up later? <laughs> Sky. Well, you'll have a date planned. Yeah. Tonight? Sky. Oh, yes, tonight. Tonight! <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Damn. Stefan. <laughs> Me and your cameraman have the same name, except mine, Stefan. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the fun facts. <laughs> oh, shit. Thanks so, my boy, my boy, my boy can see this tonight. You'll see what happens. You ready for that? Stop. You You're making me shy. You're gonna be rubbing his muscles and shit. Eh? Oh, look at you. Oh. Leave me oh. alone. You're so fun. We're just oh. gonna hang out. It's not gonna be anything crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Netflix and chill. Emphasis on the chill, okay? <laughs> I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, can you not? <laughs> that's embarrassing. Oh boy, that's the fucking internet. Once you date people on the internet, you shit in public, okay? That's why you shouldn't date influencers, okay? You hear me, Mr. Gym Guy, with your big muscles, who don't skip leg day? You have a picture? So we I don't consider myself an influencer. Whatever you consider yourself. Um, excuse me. You have a picture of this dude so we can I will absolutely not show you guys a picture of him. No, there's no way. Can I just look? No. <laughs> can I look Well, at... you can see, but they can't see. Okay, can I just... Okay, show me him, and I'll describe him to the audience. <laughs> this guy, <laughs> this guy's about to get jealous. I'm doing this for you all, homeboy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're so annoying, Sky. <laughs> Y'all can't look. I'm gonna look for you guys. Anyway, going back to Game of Thrones with Jon Snow, okay? So he was supposed to have his own spinoff, and HBO was like, fuck this, and they just canceled it. So that's not gonna happen anymore. Those of you hanging on to see what happened to J after Jon Snow returned to the wall, okay? <laughs> Dumbass ending. <laughs> all right, all right. What's up, what's up, La Soul? Okay, let me see. That's fucking handsome. Yeah, you don't think he's so handsome? What the fuck? That still ain't even muscular. He, yes, he is. He got big arms. His arms ain't bigger than his, mine. His arms. What did I say? I said Sky's about to get jealous. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I don't even really work out, homeboy. Okay, my arm got more definition than that big no, shit. No, your your arms are not as big as okay. his arms. Okay, okay. Let me see. Go slow. Go slow. <laughs> you're you're go so slow. annoying. He I'm works out a lot. They dude. his kids. He ain't got no, well, he ain't got no kids. Well, there were three kids he was just this with. This is him with his dad. Look at him. He's huge. Huge what? Muscles. I, yeah, but there's no definition. He's okay? a hater. No, there's no definition. Imagine a big a piece of chicken, right? But there's no definition, okay? It ain't yoked. That okay? was his niece or his nephew or something like that. Okay, all right, cool, cool, cool. He is yoked, Sky's hating. He wishes it was him going on this date tonight. It's okay. You can tell the audience how you really feel. No, no, no. I'm, I'm, I'm look here. Doing one date, you. Good luck. 
No, I'm so, I'm such a sweet girl, you guys. Like, I'm very unproblematic. So, I'll let y'all know how it goes. It's a reason why she's single, homeboy, okay? It's a reason why she's single. Hey, grab my ice out there, please. Grab that ice for me. It's a reason why this woman's single, okay? Whatever. <clears throat> All right? Okay, okay guys, okay, okay. You we want got the ice, the, the big ice? Yeah, no, no, I meant the, 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 the cooler. At the bottom, the cooler, the cooler, 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 cooler. The Not cooler. that. Yeah, let's take the ice out. Okay. You sure it's ready? You don't think it need, needs another hour? We put it in there at 4 o'clock yesterday. Well, we can see what happened. Yesterday we let it stay in longer, and then today we take it out a little earlier. So, some, some ice, sometimes the ice is going to be thick, sometimes it's going to be skinny, okay? I'm happy for you and your boy, though, okay? Don't be happy too soon, y'all. Like, this is very, it's very, very new. And he's straight, right? You sure he's we straight? I mean, obviously he's straight. But what do you mean obviously he's I'm straight? I'm not going to get my hopes up about nothing because dating in L.A. is really, really hard and I have no expectations. And I'm going to keep it that way because I have to protect my little heart, okay? Sure, sure. So if he makes the movie, you can give it up? Um, I don't know. It really depends on the moment. I'm not like super like pre-planned. First date? I mean, but I've known him for so long. Strong whole vibes, huh? I've known him for four or five years. Really? Yes. Really? First so date? So we'll see. I don't First know. First date? I don't know. Five minutes in? Okay. Dad, I know you were watching this. What would you do? What would you say? What's your advice is here, Dad? Type, your, type it below. I don't think he's here. <laughs> I hope not. I don't not. think he's here. I hope Why the hell are you inviting your dad to this? We, I didn't invite him. He wanted to watch. We're well, telling him he can't be watching. I thought, I don't, I don't, I don't, dad, no, you can't support me, like. No, don't, don't fucking support us here, dad, okay? We talk too much shit for you to be here, okay? And besides, half the time I call your daughter ugly and they are jeans, <laughs> which makes you ugly. And I don't need that kind of pressure. <laughs> so if you could go watch something else, okay? Go check out the news, okay? Go read a book. Go for a fucking walk. Does he smoke? Okay, smoke a joint, huh? <laughs> All right, dad, okay? You don't need to be here watching this shit with me abusing your daughter, okay? <clears throat> Thank you. Somebody said, Shayla, I hope you're not easy out here in these streets. Okay, well, I won't give it up then, you guys. Not on the first Oh, she day. giving it up. By the way, what's your body count? That's a very personal question. No, it's not. It's not it's today's world. And, to, and the only fans, can I guess? Okay. Is it less or more than 100? What the fuck? <laughs> Is that a real question? <laughs> I'm not one of those only fans girls that's just going around banging everybody left and right. Excuse me. So 100's bad? At my age, I would say, I don't, I don't want to judge. I don't slut shame, but it's not my MO. Okay. It's not how so I Okay, so you're, you're, 20, you're 28. Okay. So 28, your number should be less than what? Okay, your judgmental little shit. Okay, what should it be? I mean, giving women grace, I say less than 50. Oh, damn. No more than 50. Damn. Damn. Is anyone here 28 and over 50? Okay, 28 <laughs> and over 50. Shayla just say you're a hoe. Please, <laughs> no. how do you feel about your hoeish lifestyle? <laughs> I never said that. How do you feel about your hoe ass lifestyle? <laughs> you're so rude. Do you feel that you're a hoe? <laughs> Okay, okay. Is crazy. <laughs> okay, okay, hold on. Do you have an energy drink today? No, no, I don't need an energy drink. I have a natural high. Okay. Okay, I have a natural high. Okay, let me let me Somebody make Somebody said hundred is bad at the age. <laughs> okay, hold on. So what's the day? Wednesday? Shit, we missed Taco it's Tuesday. Hump day. It's a hum day. Okay. Guys, I have a margarita. I'm not I have a uh, I have a mimosa for you guys, okay? This is a tequila mimosa, okay? Tequila mosa. You know, most people, um, since we're going with tequila, most people, when they make a, um, a mimosa, you know, it's just champagne and OJ, okay? But this tipsy bartender, so we take things in a completely different direction all the time, you know? Arkansas said my dad is here. How do you know Arkansas? <laughs> I haven't seen this time. Yo, I'm yet. 33 and way, way less than 50. Hell, less than 15. Damn, okay. Ooh. Damn. <laughs> Basically untouched. Good for you, Danielle. That's okay. so amazing. Basically untouched. Okay. Somebody said chlamydia has entered the chat. <laughs> AIDS has entered the chat. That's crazy. AIDS has entered the chat. Y'all are hilarious. <laughs> so 100 is only fans and 50 is decent girl. <laughs> But what the word on the street okay, is Okay, but what about guys? What is a bad body count for a man? Or does it even matter? I don't think with men it's the same. Why isn't the same? Oh god, you all really won't have this conversation. Okay, this is <laughs> before I get cancelled, okay? Yes, please. Because I can see you're cancelled. Please explain. Okay. Now understand this. 
Okay, there's an expression. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> What? A lock that can be opened by any key is a shitty lock. A lock, <laughs> a, a key that could open any lock is a master key. Okay. And in that, 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 no, hold on. Let's, no, let's scratch that. that let's scratch that. Take that shit out, okay? Edit it. I'll edit that piece, okay? Fuck. Okay. Okay, hold on. Where are you hiding? Uh-oh. Come back. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me start this again. Fuck. Okay, that was getting on the wrong way. Okay, hold on. Shit. Shit, I ended up working at McDonald's soon anyway. Okay. Here's the thing. Men and women are equal. But, you know, Okay. So how many women you how many guys you've slept with girls I I don't care okay that's your roast beef you know show it to who you want okay send me a couple pics anyway <laughs> but here's the thing here's the thing if you go to a bar tonight okay any woman in this chat goes to a bar tonight you are guaranteed to get laid there's a dude there who's going to take you home you don't even have to work you just show up it's going to happen with guys we have to work You know what I mean? Okay. Like you have to so work to get it. So we have because because you have to work for it. You know, I mean, I guess a guy having a high number is more a sign of. I mean, he gets more respect than a woman who has a high number. Okay. But hey, they all hoes. Okay, they're all hoes. Okay. Once you pass a certain number, you're all hoes. Okay. Amen. All right. <laughs> Holy shit. I just lost half my subscribers now. <laughs> okay. The police looking for me. Okay. <laughs> I want to cancel this. Okay. I show up at the airport. They pulling me aside. Excuse me, Mr. Joe. We have to wait. ask you some questions. Do you hear that? What? Are those sirens outside? <laughs> <laughs> Coming to get you? The cancel police. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay. But listen. In today's world of OnlyFans, body count so, you know, it's like whatever, dude. Like... Do you, even, world you even care anymore? Do you care, Shayla? I mean... Do you? Uh, I don't know. Okay, so do me a favor. Let's grab orange juice and let's grab grenadine. Let's grab OJ, let's grab grenadine. Okay. Okay, she got grenadine. And let's gra- that's, that's enough, that's enough. We don't need much. And, and grab the orange juice out of there. You see any? Yeah. Beautiful. And I got oranges here. And let's, let's, grab, let's grab corn syrup too. I mean, I don't have to rim with corn syrup, but let's grab corn syrup. And let's grab, let's grab my salt. What, the coarse salt? Yeah. Second shelf, second, the second drawer. Yes. Okay, beautiful. Siddharth, be patient. We're going to cook something later. We're cooking something today, homeboy. Oh, I got some lasagna. I don't see any coarse salt. There's salt in there, there's salt in there, salt in there, the salt. Okay, hold on, let me see, go back. You go on camera. Hi, everybody. Who moved my salt? Who moved his salt, y'all? We don't know. It's a mystery. He's going to blame right it there? on me. Where? Oh, yeah, it's right there. Oh, okay. Thank you, Stefan. No problem. I'm the furthest. I was getting real nervous standing here alone. Why? Because you think I was going to blame me I for my salt? I was going to start talking about random stuff. Really? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. No, 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 stand there, stand there, stand there, okay? Okay, stand there. You're not allowed to leave me. Okay, okay, but chill it. You gotta be ready. If you can stand beside me, you gotta be ready. Okay, watch this. So you gotta stand here and you gotta find a topic to keep the show going, okay? So, okay, just hit me with a word. Give me a word. Pineapple, homeboy. Pineapple, okay? You could make so many drinks with a pineapple, okay? There's a Bay Breeze, which is just vodka. Okay, cranberry juice, pineapple juice, okay? Super easy, super simple. You know, pineapple. You see, you just remembered it. Hit me with another word. Black. Black. Black people. Oh, my God. Do they scare you? Sometimes they scare me. Okay, see that? Okay, just got canceled, but it was interesting. <laughs> okay. Let's not talk about black people. Scratch that. Let's, okay, where's the editor? Okay, I don't edit that piece. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, okay? Okay, hit me with another word. Minute Maid. Minute Maid, okay? Floral orange juice, which they're about to get blown away by a storm. You see, you got to keep this shit going, okay? okay? All right? Now, you go ahead, try it then, okay? Negroes, go. Negroes, don't <gasps> you love them? <laughs> <laughs> Yay, melanin. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, the show took a dark twist, okay. <laughs> 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 All right, okay, 
okay. Doing our best here. Okay. This, this show is, this show is uh, problematic. All right, guys. <laughs> so now we come in, right? <laughs> Drop the bow. <laughs> okay. So we come in, right, guys? And so what we have here is a little corn syrup. Now, I can put this on with lime. But corn syrup is going to hold better and give us a prettier rim, okay? So let me just get a little plate. And just get a little... <laughs> What? What you laughing at? Cool dad, Cody said, gave her the worst word. <laughs> <laughs> Dirk, that dude said, y'all wrong for this. <laughs> Saint said, what did I just walk into? <laughs> a hot mess, y'all. All right, okay. Mess. okay, 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 okay. <laughs> Oh, DJ Bozak in the house. I love hoes. Oh, where to go, DJ Bozak? <laughs> Bozak, everybody does, you know. They just act like they don't. They just act like they don't. You know what I mean? You know how many guys I watch on those red pill shows, you know, like those podcasts going, I can't believe, you know, they, they interview an OnlyFans girls and they're going like, you do this, you do that. Uh, uh, uh. And you know, the minute that camera cut off, he's like, so what's your number? We should go out, blah, blah, blah. You, you could see it, dude. Yeah. They're so full of shit. You know what I mean? Iron Fan says, Sky and Shade are going to be on 60 Minutes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. So now we come around. So guys, I just drop in my light corn syrup on the side here. You could, you could use a lime, guys. I mean, a lime's easier, but it's not going to give you as pretty of a rim. You know what I mean? So it really depends on what you want. If you want a pretty rim, use corn syrup. But if you're looking... You know, for a rim that make more sense, just use lime, okay? So I put that in there, run it around. You guys have seen me do this with sugar. Now I'm doing it with salt. And considering the champagne, why you want a salted champagne rim is beyond me, but hey. <coughs> okay? Good. Sorry. If that had broken, I would have blamed you, okay? Sorry, if that had broken, ooh, Shayla. Ooh, that was coming out your page. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm getting a heart attack. I'm sorry. You know what, for screaming? Yeah. What are you screaming for? Reflex. You're going through some shit? Okay. <laughs> Look at that, okay? Look DJ Bozak said nice rim job. Excellent, homeboy. When it comes to rim jobs, I'm one of the best, okay? <laughs> I was rated California's best rim job master. Okay, there you go. Let's go back right. All right, beautiful. Okay. Do you know that song is stuck in my head now? Which one? I got hoes in different area codes. <laughs> That's ludicrous, son. That's <laughs> ludicrous, son. I'm, I'm the boy. I'm. Yeah. Oh God, he died. Oh, Nate. Ludacris and Nate Dog. Different area code and different. I remember when Nate Dog died. Okay. All right, guys. So let us begin this mimosa, okay? So we're coming in with a touch of tequila. All right, Sheila, just give us a little bit of tequila in there. Not much, because it ain't really about the tequila. So give us like half an ounce of tequila, okay? That's good. That's good. That's good. Now, guys, that don't look like much, right? But again, it's a mimosa, all right? It ain't supposed to be loaded. I'm sorry, Sean. I did not mean to scare you. I actually scared myself, too, in the yeah. process. Okay, Shayla, grab us some. Um, pour, pour, the, pour, the, pour the OJ up to about here. Really? I thought you were supposed to put the champagne first and then the OJ. Homeboy, just tipsy bond and we do what we want. Keep going, keep going, keep going, and stop. Okay, grab me champagne. There might be one open, actually. Yes, Marin. Everybody's heart is beating fast. <laughs> Everyone's heart's beating fast after what? After the scream? Yeah. Sorry. Shayla screaming. Okay, you see champagne in there, Shayla? Yes. La Soul says, I'm using that. Can you make me a nice rim job? <laughs> I'm hitting, I can hit you back in a sec. I'll hit you back in a few hours. Okay. All right. Cody says he can't mess with Minimate. Why no. not? What's wrong with Minimate? What's wrong with Minimate, homeboy? Okay? It's from Florida. He don't like Floridians. Okay? Okay, guys. Now come behind that with our little champ. Thank you for the super chat, Six. Thanks a lot. Sidarth, I love Asian cuisine. I've been really obsessed with Korean, specifically, flavors you've lately. Been trying to, you've been trying to cook Korean? Korean flavors lately, yeah. Uh, Okay, look at that. It's pretty. Now, guys, notice something. I poured the, I, okay, you could pour the champagne first the way Shayla said, right? But if you pour the champagne first, it's likely going to froth up more than if you pour the orange juice first. 
And what that does is that saves my rim because typically when you put a shampoo in first, it rises up, you don't control it, drains over the side, all my salt's gone. That makes sense? Mm -hmm. You see? Kelsey says, the last time I had a tequila spiked mimosa, I blacked out. Oh boy. Okay, well, we bring him, we bring him back, we bring him back memories, okay? The thing I like about this cheap ass champagne is the screw on top because mm -hmm. it saves it, you know? Like every time I pop this, it's like popping it for the first time. You notice that? I like it too. Um, Ari Lennox has a song about this brand. Andre? Well, Who? She, she has a lyric in her song about Andre. Who? Ari Lennox. Okay, what she says about it? Half an ounce she said, Arkansas. Um, Dollar Tree wine glasses in the air, Andre will get me there. <laughs> Okay, guys, we come behind with a little grenadine. I like to pour it in the cap because if you pour it directly in, you might overpour, make the drink too red, okay? So coming down here. Is that good enough for the red bottle? More, Shayla? Oh, yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. That's I can good? see the gradients. You all like that? They can see it, too. I'm looking at the camera. That's enough, though? I think so. Okay. It's beautiful. Okay, homeboy. Now, at this, at this particular point, you could go lemon, I'm sorry, you could go lime or orange, because I already have a half cut lime here. Let's just go with the lime. Do I want to put a wheel on? Not necessarily. I could put one of these on, and I could hook it on the side like that, so we have that. How's that look? Oh, that's pretty. You see? Now, homeboy, check that out, okay? Oh, that's pretty. You see what we just did there? Yeah. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Iron Fantasy gorgeous. says he wants more red. He wants more red? Yeah, but I don't want to overdo it, Iron Fan, okay? <laughs> it's easy to mess up a drink with grenadine. Never pour this directly from the bottle because you will always overpour, no matter how much control you think you have. You know, this befuddles the best of them. So go ahead, Shayla. You ready? Yes. What is this called? This right here, homeboy, is a. Tequila Sunrise Mimosa. So the Tequila Sunrise is? Tequila with orange juice and grenadine. Beautiful. And so you're adding a mimosa in on that. You're adding champagne in on that, turn it into mimosa. Okay? Even though I'm pretty sure it's actually, um, instead of grenadine, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's cranberry juice. Really? You can Google it. For what? Because I think I'm right. I know you're fucking wrong, but go ahead, Google it. I feel it. like we Googled it a couple weeks ago and I turned out to be right. Okay. I don't know how much tequila you can taste, though, because again... Yeah, I don't taste much tequila, but it's tasty. Because the tequila at the bottom, you know what I mean? So if we, to, to, to mix that up, it's going to change the color of the drink, you know? Mm-hmm. You like it? Uh-huh. Got it all over your lip? Where does spit salt everywhere in my house, homeboy? The salt is crazy, but yes, it's good. But again, you don't have to put on all the salt, you know, but it keeps it sexy. So you have to ask yourself, come on, girls. Don't y'all wear giant high heel shoes with them 12 inch, 12 inch heels. You all know they're uncomfortable, but you all do it because you all sexy. 12 inches is crazy. Six inch heels then, yeah, okay? Six inches is six crazy inch. too. And then like y'all can even walk in them. Half y'all can't even walk. You know what I mean? Like y'all, oh. <laughs> Ankles be busted open to yeah, the side. Yeah, you know what I mean? Thank you, Henry. Thank you. Hey, thank you, Henry. Appreciate it, man. We appreciate it, okay? We appreciate the love, homeboy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Very, very much. Tasty, tasty. So, guys, y'all got to check this shit out, man. So, there is a, um, there is a, there's a priest, okay, who uh -oh. was <laughs> recently <laughs> jailed. <laughs> Guess what he did? Did he touch a little boy? No, there's no little boys involved. Can you believe that shit? What Congratulations. Get him out. Get him Seven. Guess Give us a clap, okay? Give us a clap, all right? All right? Okay, so what did he do? Okay. He had a fucking orgy party, right? <laughs> a priest? He had an orgy party, yes, okay? Oh, gosh. Naturally, he's a bunch of dudes, okay? <laughs> How this came to light is because one of the dudes at the party took too much Viagra, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and almost died. And OD'd. Did he die? <laughs> no, he passed out. But these dudes, did, okay, so someone called, a, someone called an ambulance, right? But the priest didn't want the ambulance to come in because this is his official residence, you know what I mean, that the church pays for, right? Where he having his party. So they didn't want to let the dude in, the, the, the ambulance in. Oh Finally, the police had to come and tell them to open up. And that's how the ambulance, the paramedics got in to save this dude. Why did somebody dude. just take him to the 
hospital. They I don't know. Leave. But hold on. The dude who OD'd on the freaking drugs was a hooker. <laughs> wow. But, but, guys, no one underage, okay? There were no kids okay, in this. So, good. I mean, hey, okay? I think this is a positive step. So, what did he get arrested for? <laughs> he got arrested for... Failing to aid someone who was oh, okay. in yeah, who was in medical need and knowing that you had control. Because remember, he did not allow the dudes to come in. Because he didn't. I thought know. there were laws against that, though. What? Wasn't there a law passed where it's like? Um, I, th I thought there was. First, a law this 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 didn't happen in the states. But go on. Oh, okay. What are you gonna I say? thought there was a law passed where, like, if you're at a party and then somebody ODs. Um, you can't get in, if you call the cops and they come in, you can't get in trouble for having drugs or whatever because Well, like, well that's, that's something that they pass because so many people have been over ODing on, um, you know, on, on heroin or fentanyl, right? And, stuff, and so yeah. they want people to call the police and not worry about that. Yeah. His situation is different. Okay. He's, he's not concerned about that. He didn't want the police come in him. because he's a fucking priest. So he knew he was going to get in trouble. So this is why, you know what I mean? But what I'm saying is you can have an orgy, right? I don't have orgies here. How I much Viagra did you take? I don't know. This dude was trying to damn bang a bull. He, he took everything. <laughs> okay. So wait, did he you was chewing you, Viagra like so chiclets. You, your, your penis doesn't explode or anything like that if you take too much? I don't think it goes down. Or your there's balls been, don't explode. There's been tons of cases where it doesn't go down. Ever. That's why, that's why if you are listening to the ads, they said, if you have an erection lasting longer than four hours, <laughs> Please Go to the hospital. call someone, yeah, because that's not normal, you know what I mean? And do it, that's gonna be painful, okay? That is gonna be painful, all right? Yeah. yeah. That's hilarious. So keep this priest in your prayers, ladies and gentlemen. So, but he's probably not gonna be put away for that long. I right? think he only got like a month or something, isn't it? Is he gonna get his priest revoked? Probably. Pro I mean, who knows? Yeah. They might transfer him to a different diocese for all I know. That's the way they usually work it, right? Y'all can't considering, be having orgies if Considering you're... there's no little boys involved, you know, I'd be like, you know what, hey? That's Come on. crazy. Do your though. thing. Do your thing. It's crazy that it's like, oh, a priest goes to jail, <laughs> but we're happy that there's no kids involved because it happens so often where kids are involved. Now we're just like yeah, crazy. Really say, you know, let, 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 give, give my boy a break. Give my boy a break. It's okay. It's okay. You know what I mean? Just be careful throwing your rages. <laughs> Insane. What's going on in the Diddy world? Any, any, anything new? Oh, well, his son is in trouble. <laughs> La Soul is asking if this was during the eclipse. <laughs> <laughs> was it? <laughs> no, no, this isn't during the eclipse. This, well, is, this, is, kind of this, is, this is before the eclipse. This is before the eclipse. Okay? <laughs> it's not during the... La Soul, it's not during the eclipse, okay? <laughs> although, although in California, dude, there's a woman who... There's a woman who during the eclipse... Stephen, she, she killed a kid, right? Her own kid. She killed a kid and her husband too, right? I think she stabbed her husband and then she drove off and threw her little baby out of the drive. Oh, out of the car or something like and that. And then she crashed the car and, and, ki and killed herself. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And Be it was because of the eclipse? Yes, yeah. because, because she was an astrologist. Uh, you know. Um, okay. She was into astrology and I guess, you know, them tarot cards lined up and they were like, hey, it's time, you know? And so she did it. Look, anytime there's an eclipse, there's some weird shit happening, okay? Especially like in the ancient world. If they saw an eclipse in the ancient world, homeboy. Have you seen Apocalypto? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They got to execute a hundred virgins, you know what I mean? Yeah. And half the girls can, I ain't even a virgin, but okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, we can throw the virgin into the fire, okay? And they drop her in and then a couple dudes is like, oh boy, she wasn't a virgin, okay? Well, shit, we got to get another. Are you a virgin? <laughs> Are you a virgin? Okay, who was a virgin? <laughs> Do we? Oh my God, who, who'd you sleep with? Really? Okay. We need to find a virgin, okay? <laughs> okay. The only virgin's not dudes, Yo, okay? This eclipse shit is wild. The only man. virgin's not dudes, man. <laughs> like, <laughs> what in the hell? <laughs> Apparently dudes aren't getting no dudes aren't getting no play anymore, you know? <laughs> young dudes struggling, man. Young dudes are young dudes are, are, are struggling. If you ever have a thought to go murder somebody, just go ahead and murder yourself first because Have you ever thought of kid about killing someone? No, I've never thought about killing somebody. Do you think you could do it? I don't think I could, which sucks, because it's like, if it's you against me, <laughs> then shit. Okay, do you think if you killed someone that you could go and sleep peacefully that night? Or do you think that'll be on your Hell mind? to the absolute no. You know what one of my biggest fears is? What? Running over an animal. Shit. One time my grandma ran over a squirrel and I almost like had a heart attack. Like, 
I like drop down to my knees and like. Do you still think about it now? Sometimes like you're in the shower and you go down, that's cool. No, I don't think about it now. But there was one time where I killed a bug and I felt really, really bad after. What kind of fucking bug was this? What, like a little lady it bug? It was a little bug, but I just felt so bad. Like I was like, damn, I could have just like threw it out the window, you know? Yeah, could have talked so, to it, you know yeah, what I mean? yeah, I don't have that in my heart, y'all. Okay, she's not a killer, guys. She's not a killer, okay? This is definitely not a person you'll be hanging with you in the apocalypse. Will I cut you? That's a different story. This is definitely not someone... You know, someone said the ugliest girl can get laid. The ugliest dude has no chance. Very true, very true. I mean, if he has a sense of humor, he does. You think so? If you're ugly, just be funny, dude. Really? Like, you ever seen all those hot girls with them ugly ass dudes? <laughs> Guaranteed it's because he's hilarious. <laughs> or rich. Period. <laughs> One of the two. Or both. <laughs> yeah, anyway. Oh, by the way, that Simmons girl um, st claiming now that the old dude she was with wasn't a boyfriend. Guys, if you watch our last two, last, the, the last so two episodes. The last two episodes, Russell Simmons' 21-year-old daughter, Aoki, okay, was dating this 65-year-old dude. He had, he had her in St. Bart's on the beach and they were making out. And apparently, oh, hey, thank you, thank you. Thanks, Iana. Guys, remember, the main feed is on YouTube, okay? So we want you to come over to YouTube and become a member, okay? So you can help us buy booze. Or make a donation to the alcohol fund, which Iona just did. Thank you very much. But anyway, now she claiming the dude wasn't a boyfriend. And apparently they fell out because she, she wanted a Cartier bracelet or something like that. They fell out over that, Something and he like didn't that. want to get it for her? I don't know. I mean, he could afford it. He worth like 250 million. But he probably knew that she was using him, clearly. I mean, she clearly used him, right? But girls, okay. Do you okay. think she gave it up? Do you think he would have gotten her the bracelet if she gave it up? Probably, right? So she probably didn't even give it up. Dude, you if, think? if you got a girl in St. Bart's... That don't mean that, they, that she's giving it up. No, but I'm thinking this. Okay, firstly, see, I ain't... Especially if they broke up right afterwards. Okay, if I'm, if I'm a wealthy guy, firstly... Ain't nowhere we flying somewhere unless we've already done something. You know what I mean? Because I'm not taking you to St. Bart's on speculation. But what if you're an old guy and you fly somewhere in the hopes of getting what you want? Yeah, but I ain't You're doing like, it. okay, since you're not giving it to me now, let me take you on vacation. Okay, but, but okay, hold on, hold on. Firstly, firstly, let's understand old guys because their mentality a lot different from younger guys, okay? Because in talking to older dudes, the world. No, the world, no, 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 ain't no chivalry. The world is just a little bit different. Okay, firstly, you know, as a young guy, and I take you to dinner and things don't work out, and I spend $200 on this dinner, like I'm upset, you know what I mean? I spend $200, I ain't get laid, I ain't got nothing to show for it, right? Okay. All guys, especially ones who have money, that kind of money don't matter. You know, even if it's 10 Gs, it's like, what the fuck? If the dude's a multimillionaire, he don't fucking really care about that, you know okay. what I mean? So the mentality different on that as well. Also... Sex is important, but not as important as the companionship. Like, you like someone who's going to be there to keep your company. You see what I'm saying? And so the way she was shushing him in that video and not uh, letting him speak. See, yeah, you ain't shushing me. Fuck you, okay? He was literally trying to talk, and she was like, shh, be quiet, be quiet. And I'm like... It ain't even like she's even that fine. You don't talk to you like Y'all know we talk about stuff. You can show a picture of her. Ioki, Ioki Simmons and this restaurant tour dude. He's going to find a picture of her right now, guys. Anyway, so... But my thing is, my thing with that is, she's now claiming that they weren't dating and all kinds of stupid shit. But the news is saying she wanted... I mean, they were kissing. And yeah, the pictures. news is saying... It would be the day before that, maybe on the 8th, you know? Um, yeah, yeah, that's them there. Yes, 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 I yes. I mean, she's cute. You don't think she's cute? I mean, she look exotic. You could tell she's mixed with a bunch of stuff. Because she's Asian black, right? Yeah. Yeah, but I mean, I'm, just, I'm just saying, you know, poor guy. You know, he, he messed up. So, okay, a lot of people are asking for glittery drinks. They really want a glittery drink. Oh, shit. Someone asked me about a glittery drink yeah, yesterday. Next somebody. Hey, Red. Red. Any pink lemonade down there? Do you want me to go look? No, she's looking. Let her look. Okay. What, what, what are you looking at? Yeah, but I'm, I'm just saying, like, I mean... Sometimes it's companionship. She might have enjoyed the company, you know what I mean? But I don't want a girl who like, Sky, I need shoes. I need a That's bracelet. That's what she was doing the I whole I need damn this. Trip. I need that. I can look, bitch. Get the fuck out of here, That's man. That's what she was okay? doing the whole time. Get your ass out of here. Yeah. I don't have time to put up with your bullshit. The whole time. You know what I mean? Mm hmm Yeah. It was me. So, so Lex. Oh, you asked for it. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. We're, we're going to get you yeah, that. Yeah, we, we can get you that right now. We, 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 we're checking. We're checking. Um, 
a, a little storage. Oh, let's check on this ice now. Okay? The ice. Yeah. Or something just happened to Devin. What's Did the computer die? What Did happened? the monitor die? The monitor's out. Oh, there we go. Sorry. There we go. Yo. Oh, I'll grab it. Hey, listen. I need, I need glitter too. The pink glitter. Edible glitter. Okay. Pink edible glitter. This can be just a basic margarita though, but it would, it would be pink and it would be cool. Ste Shayla, let's get those. You want to put this back in the fridge? Yeah, you can put that back. Let's keep this. Let's keep that. Let's get some triple sec up in this bad boy. We could hit this with a couple lemons too. Okay, let me get let me get the water out of here. Yeah. You always gotta get rid of the water. Oh, wow. Damn, that's all over my socks now. My socks it's are soaked. It's so thin. Yeah, it's a thin, it's a thin, because it wasn't in there long enough, you know? Oh no, not your sock. Wet socks are the worst feeling. I got wet socks on, but my toes are wet, and I did it for you. It's Remember that? Ringing. Oh, I thought you rang your sock out in the uh, <laughs> sink just now. I'm not ringing socks out. I'm you got it? Thank you. Okay. Oh boy. Sheila, grab, 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 the, grab the hammer. It's called diamond dust. Grab the hammer and the knife. <laughs> bam, bam. Come on, come back. Oh, this this really this really a thin one. That's what I said. What did I say? I mean it's really thin, but it is what it is. Where's the knife? You got the knife? On the side there. Oh, look at look behind you. Behind? Mm-hmm. That Ladies. doesn't seem safe to just have that knife just laying in there like that. Okay, so, so hold that up so they could see it. You want to give them a, a preview of what it looks like? Oh my gosh, can you see me through here? No. Clear eyes, homeboy. Clear eyes. Okay, Shayla will be cutting. Oh, okay. You need a glove? Yeah, I'll do one glove because I don't like when my hands get cold. Your little bitch ass hands, huh? <laughs> you need more manly hands, homeboy. Really? <laughs> anyway, so Russell, so so going back to that to that thing. I mean, I she's denying that they ever dated. Kind of, but I feel, I, feel, I she's denying him. I feel, I feel he feel made a mistake. No, because why you go public with it though? Why you got her on the beach making out with a dude? This supposed to be behind closed doors. Uh, not me, got both. Yeah, you know I, what I mean. Like you don't need to go public with no twenty-one fucking year old. I mean, but hey, maybe now all the chicks are going to be after him. You never know. It might have been a good thing. What? So you want to track more gold diggers? Huh? <laughs> were you on a gold digger quest? What, is, what are you trying to do? That's fine. Keep going. And guys, guys just joining us for the first time, this is a regular cooler. I just take the top off so that when I put it in the freezer, the ice begins to freeze from the top down and creating clear ice, okay? Damn, you haven't cut a piece properly yet. Yes, I did. You see this one? It's beautiful. It's beautiful, oh, Sky. Wow. Look at this. Look how clear it is. Mm -hmm. It's so beautiful. He Sky. just has to talk shit, y'all. If he, if Sky goes five minutes without saying something, then he might have an aneurysm. Look at that. Look at that homeboy. The hell is that shit? Mrs. Stone says you become an expert at cutting clear eyes, Shayla. Thank you, Strong. Is she though? Is she though? He's giving me more credit than you are. I'm gonna just have this big chunk right here. Hey, Strong, by the way, I realized that I could kind of do a Beef Wellington doing a live show by doing it in stages, you know what I mean? Like one day making the dough, making this, like over the period of like about three days, making the, the, the duck cell, this day and you know on and on and on and, and everyone wraps it and crepes now doing that I mean we can see we can see we can see Mr. Strawn we can see Professor Strawn do we need a new bag because this one's pretty full hey city boy I can use a lot of bag. this right now 
Should I make it this size though? Or is this too? Actually, let me find a different glass. Hold on before you, before you take out ice out of that. Or should we do it this? We haven't used that one yet. I know, but I mean, you want, see, you want to see the sparkles in it, so let's find a glass that would show the sparkles. You wouldn't see the sparkles in that glass? Hmm? You wouldn't see the sparkles in that glass? Not as much as you would see it in a taller one where, you, where we could swirl. Okay. Okay, so let's do this. Yes. Okay. So put the front camera. Huh? Put it on front camera. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. So let's, let's, so let's, um, let's get rid of those. Shell is bagging up our clear ice, guys. Come from behind us so they can see that. Okay. Dang, you have a big bag now. Yes, ma'am. Okay. We good? Yep. Okay. All right. Welcome back, Marin. I hope the chicken works out. What chicken? She's making chicken. She's making chicken. Okay. And okay. somebody says I, I sound like a Texan. Really? Like, <laughs> no really? way. <laughs> a German Texan? A German Texan. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> a German Texan. Okay. Hi, Annette, you beautiful woman, you. Hey, speaking of Texas. Speaking of Texas. Uh oh. Okay, y'all remember this AI thing I talk about all the time, and y'all like, ah, oh, Sky, you just, ex you said that to obsessed me. Obsessed with AI. You're just obsessed with AI. Okay, check this out. Every single year, Texas has to hire 6,000 graders, right? These are the people who grade their exams, okay? What do you mean? For like, for school? Yeah, there's, a, there's, a, there's an exam that they have. I think it's called a star exam or something like that, okay? okay? The whole state takes it, and they need, they have 6,000 people to come out and grade it, because this isn't graded by your teacher. This is like one of, their, one of their big exams, you know? Okay. Okay, so they have to hire 6,000 people. So guess what they're doing this year? AI? This year, they're allowing AI to grade so it. So what about those 6,000 people? Well, that's what we're getting into. So in, by them allowing AI to do it, they don't have to hire the 6,000. They'll be able to hire less than 2,000, okay, to grade these. And the state will be saving between 15 and $20 million by doing this. So look for that shit to go to every fucking company. Obviously, not every company grades exams. So what I'm saying is look for AI to replace similar amounts of people in tons of different in industries. This is coming and it's coming fast. Because everybody be like, oh, it's going to be five years. Dude, ask the people who are grading exams. They're out of a job right now. You, you see what I'm so saying? Messed up, dude. Yeah. This shit's moving, man. I mean, I guess it's not messed up for, the, for them making more money, but just like find another job, I guess. Who? But it's not a year long job, anyways. Probably no, it's a temporary it. job, but you got to understand. I'm sure there are people who've been doing that for years, years and have been and counting years. on the money, you see? And this is the way it is. Like, they have just so many people out of work. And it can creep in on every industry in different ways. Definitely in Hollywood, because we're already feeling it with AI music. Not AI my industry. Bartending. Mm -hmm. Your industry, definitely, homeboy. But it's going to take a long time. You just, saw, you just saw the Drake and The Weeknd put out a fucking hit song that they didn't sing? What are you talking about? Yeah, but I'm talking about bartending. Oh, you mean bartending? I yeah, thought you yeah, meant yeah, singing. Yeah. Well, all the, all the bars in Vegas, like on, when you gamble it on the floor, those drinks are made in a, in a main kitchen by machines. Those aren't bartenders pouring those drinks. So the waitress would pull up there with her glass or whatever, put it there, type in something, and the shit spits it out. But the goat group bars are always going to have girls. No, they can always have girls. I mean, a little dive bar like that, yes, those, those would be fine for now. We have to see how things progress. Besides, Gen Z ain't drinking alcohol any fucking way. You know that, right? I know. These dudes hardly drinking, okay? Guys, enjoy your liquor because it's probably going to extinct soon. <laughs> you, know? you know, during the apocalypse, oh boy, it could be me and two of you all in the bushes drinking uh, peach snaps, okay? And I'm going to be in the bushes dancing like this. Yeah, yeah, okay, behind us trying to get a shot, okay? <laughs> Guys, if it's the apocalypse and you see Shayla, please, please, whatever you do, Take go the other me. way. No, no, no. Go Take the me other in. way, Take okay? She's going to cause you all to get killed. Take me in. Okay. So let's come back to my girl's drink, okay? So, <laughs> yeah, so let's let's start with a little bit of tequila, okay? We going with an ounce of tequila. You want to measure this or no? You just count. Okay, let's go in with some tequila. Hi. Not there, not there, homeboy. We we get in a mixing glass. What's wrong with you? You see two glasses here. Were you blind? How much was that you pour? Huh? Just like a like a what? Huh? Okay, that's enough. All right. Two glasses. 
Okay? You got to pay attention, homeboy. I'm not supposed to know. You're lucky your dad watching, because I would have spanked you. I don't think he's watching. Okay, now nah, I'm spanking you anyway, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Next, we come behind that with a little triple sec. <laughs> Okay. okay, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You want to put agave in this? A little bit, yeah. Let's grab agave syrup. Okay. Shale is going for the agave. Okay. Agave is... But agave, you can't easily overdo it, so... I know, but you, you can just go light. And be careful when you open that, because this comes up fast. So flip it's it up. It's like sticky and shit. Fli yeah, flip it upside down. Flip it like this. And let's just get a little bit of agave. Okay, guys? Any more? More? Okay, there you go. That ain't much. Perfect. Okay, now let's come behind that with a little bit of pink lemonade. You want come with it? You want any? Let's squeeze in a little bit of lime juice. We don't need it, but just a little bit. Perfect. Three drops. Okay. Now let's come behind that with some pink lemonade. More, more, more. Keep going. Keep going. Were you scared? Is that good? No, but you see how much liquor in there, poor. What the fuck are you doing? That's so much. Wow. How much booze in here? Um, two ounces. Okay, what percentage of this is booze? The booze was up to about here, right? So that's but just. But there was also an ice in there. Nah, but that's just two to one. So it's the an ice, optical illusion. The ice still in there. Hey, David. Thanks for tuning in. The ice is still in there. Thank you, David. Mariners asking what agave? Huh? What's agave? So agave is a agave is, agave nectar is a sweetener that you usually use with tequila. It's very sweet. It's something that we usually um use with tequila. Like when it's tequila, people typically don't use simple syrup. They use agave. Okay, it goes because. Well, it's blue agave nectar, so this is the same nectar, this is the same, same, uh, is agave a fruit? It is, it's, right? It's a cactus, right? Yeah, whatever, okay? It's from the same thing as the tequila. Tequila's, tequila's made from blue agave. This particular thing is made from blue agave as a sweetener for tequila, okay? Frank said, that ain't a drink no more, just lemonade now. No, Frank, a bunch of booze in here. Let's see if she can taste it. Here, shake that. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What hold you on. mean? Hold on. I forgot. Oh, the glitter. Let's watch this. Okay. So we come in with our glitter. Wow. Okay. That is pretty. Okay. You'll see the glitter. Shake it and this keep it This would be a perfect drink to make my friend for her birthday. Who's your friend? Tori. Her favorite color is pink. Have I met Tori? Mm-mm. Hey Diddy from Chicago, thanks for tuning in. So, hey, say Chicago. Diddy from Chicago? <laughs> the dude named Diddy? Maybe it's DD. Hold on, hold on before you pour that though. I need a towel, my hands got wet. Your hands got wet? It sure did. Hey, and where my tweezers? They're in here, I saw them. Before you freak out. Well, sweet. Okay. All right. Pretty. Hey from Charlotte. Da, 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 da. Hey Stephanie from Charlotte. And guess what? If you want to. You could still come in with a little bit more if you wanted to. And then we just pour over. There's some ice in there. You can like yeah, I don't mind it. I don't mind that coming out. We could use more ice. It's pretty. You know ice in here. It's so pretty. It melted? Yeah. It melted with the shaking. Okay, let me see. Where's where's the Hey Chris? Hello. And this, in this straw right here, I don't yeah, know if you can see. Yeah, that's a, that's a changing color straw. Yeah, it's perfect for this. Guys, the glitter is hard to see. on. on no, you on can this. see it. You can see it? Yep. Looks dope. Yeah. The glitter is hard to see, though. Go ahead, Sheila. Push the straw in. Boom! That's what we're talking about. Go ahead, take a little sip of that bad boy. Oh, it's good. 
You like it? Yeah. This one, this one, this is a simple one, guys. So, so I mean, with this. We, it do, don't it? What? He said everything you make will be looking good. Yeah, well, I mean, I specialize in beauty, you know what I mean? Why is your name City Boy? Because <laughs> he's from the city. Where you think he's from, huh? The country? Huh? Are the you rural a area? City Boy, like a city girl? City Boy. City Boy's up. Excuse me. Like, why is your name City Boy? What kind of up dumb 100. shit is that, huh? Okay, sorry. No. Can you hold it one more time into camera? Oh. No, no like in this one. Um. And then twirl it around. Can you guys see the... Uh, I don't know if you could see it though, guys. A little bit closer to the oh, camera. Oh yeah, you can see it. Don't worry, guys. When oh, if you put something behind it, a black shirt or something. Guys, don't worry. As we grow, no, you can see it. Watch, 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 watch. As we grow, we have a we have a bigger right budget. Here. You see it swirling right there, y'all. You see it. Okay. Guys, as we grow, we get a bigger budget. We could have a cameraman who could come in close and get some of this stuff. So we ain't moving the camera around and shit. But we ain't there yet. We got ways to go, okay? <laughs> there's glitter in there. Yeah, there's there's glitter in here. And this is for my girl. What was her name? Um, Lexi. What was the name? That was Lexi's name? Lexi. City Boy said, I've never been to the South. I always lived in this city my whole life. Okay. Makes sense, makes sense. What city you live in? Brooklyn? What what city does he live in? Mm-hmm. Okay, hold tight now. Hold tight. All right. Okay. It's good, Manny. It's good. And there's glitter in here. Okay. Gosh darn it. Yeah. I'm writing down this drink, though. Who was this named after? What was, who was this, whose drink was this? Lexi's. We got a super jet. Her name was Lexi? Can you remake the Truth Lifestyle for 2011? What? <laughs> the, can you remake the Truth Lifestyle? What are you talking about? Can they see the top of the glass? Oh, Lex, hey, this, Le that's the name? Lexi? Sorry, Lexi Mariah? Sorry. Lexi Mariah. Lexi okay. Mariah. Yeah. My bad, y'all. I was trying to get y'all to see it. It's in there. There's glitter. Okay. City boys up home. Hey, Lexi. <laughs> I can call this the Lexi. Okay, so Lexi. What's her name again? Let me see the name. Lexi Mariah. Okay, so I can call this the Lexi Pink Lemonade, all right? Love it, love it, love it. So this is the Lexi. The Lexi Lemonade. The Lexi Pink Lemonade. I like Lexi Lemonade better because it, it, like it flows better. Okay, really? The Lexi Lemonade. Cool, cool. Okay. <laughs> okay. What? 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 Tequila, triple sec. Okay. Minute Maid, pink lemonade, agave. Uh huh. Agave. The tiniest little squeeze of lime. Lime juice. Diddy. Oh. <laughs> pink lemonade. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. I know that's not you, liar. <laughs> Is it the real Diddy? Of course not. Is it the real Diddy up in here? Diddy in the house. Do it. Do it. He got so much dudes in rap talking shit. He got to stop with them first. Oh, God. If he did come at me, that'd make my day, though. How do you know it's not him? Huh? How do you know it's not him? It's a picture of him. Oh, shit. Huh? It's a picture of him. I know it's a picture of him. I'm just saying. Do you know how to work your phone? Do you need help? Yeah, I, I'm good. Thank you. Thank you for your <laughs> smart ass suggestions. Okay? Okay. All right, guys. I just, I just had to save that recipe. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. I just had to save that recipe. Homeboy, today, the meal we're cooking is legit. You ready for this? What is it? Huh? We're doing a lasagna, okay? But we're doing an unusual lasagna, okay? Look. Is it going to be with Doritos? Look at the definition. Your boy at the gym ain't got that. Look at that. Hey, homeboy at the gym. Fat boy. His muscles are bigger than yours. Fat boy. You see this? Huh? His huh? muscles Can are bigger than Can I call him fat yours? boy? And he trains, so he could, he could knock you out. And he trains. Knock who out? Knock who out? Homeboy. Knock who out? You can't hit me. I'm too fast. Okay. <laughs> huh? I sting like a butterfly. Fly like a bee. Look at that. Huh? Look at that. Whoa! Okay. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Okay? You can't touch me, okay? Diddy should put his head in a hole. Oh, hold on now, Barbara. What kind of thing is that? Diddy should put his head in a hole to arch his back. What are you trying to do, Bob? Okay? You mean he should put his head in a hole, okay? That sounds deeply sexual. <laughs> Two dollars is all Diddy can afford now. Diddy rich, man. Diddy? Did he? He's not that rich, y'all. He's Ooh. not as rich as we think he is. Who, Diddy? A lot of his money don't even belong to him. He, he just paid... Cassie, a hundred million dollars to shut her mouth. I, that dude's very wealthy. He ain't gonna be wealthy for long, not with all these lawsuits. Yeah, but then you gotta win them. Now, uh, granted, the thing is, he paying a lot of money in legal fees. 
like a lot, a lot, a lot. You know what I mean? It just sucks that like he has to be a bad person because I really did love his last album. And now I feel like I can't do a cover of it or like, you know, because people are going to be like, isn't that Diddy's song? And the, you know, like, just change it up. Support you Diddy. And you know, like his last album was so good, y'all. Really? It was so good. Okay. If you like R&B, you will love it. It's so good. Okay, let's put this stuff behind us. What, what, what do you mean you would love it? Because it's an R&B album. And all the songs are fire. Woody. It? it is what it is, y'all. Yo, Elliot, we made the diddler yesterday. Oh boy, we made the yeah. diddler yesterday. Okay, and by the way, so this weekend, I'm uploading the diddler, the Arkansas, the Eclipse, and also Diddler, Arkansas, Eclipse. There was one more. The, uh, the La Soul. La Soul. Yeah, and the Bambi. And the Bambi. That's like five drinks from you guys, okay? Pretty much all the drinks I posted now, like on shorts, is, is, from, is from the members, you know what I mean? Nice. Even though Lexi ain't a member, Lexi got lucky because she came through, you know? <laughs> guys, I got to get some water in here. Look at that strong stream, homeboy. That's how I am when I hit the bathroom, homeboy. Blast your eye out. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You wish. I'm all over the floor now. All right? <laughs> <laughs> Emma always like, Sky, you missed the toilet. Motherfucker, the toilet move, you know what I mean? Like, you know. <laughs> that was my ex. What, he used to always miss the toilet? Yes. And it used to really piss me off. How would he miss? Because I would go in the bathroom and sit on the toilet, and because he just peed on the floor, now I can smell fucking piss. Oh, God, yeah. Look, being a man is hard, okay? No, it's not that hard. Let me explain to something, the okay? Toilet. You wake up in the morning, okay? There's still boogers in your the eyes. The toilet is like this big. Okay? You How get you boogers it? in your eyes, okay? And you stumble in the bathroom, okay? All right? And your back still arched the wrong way, okay? And then you, the, you, the thing in the morning going this way and you're trying to get it to go that way, okay? And mistakes happen, okay? Mistakes happen. That's why men's bathroom is so horrible because mistakes happen, okay? Horrible. Just horrible. Yeah. It's hard being a man, girls. It's hard, <laughs> okay? Some of you are lucky. You're Michael lucky. said you started you start missing the toilet in your fifties. He was twenty eight years old missing a freaking toilet. Didn't make no damn sense. What did you? What did he say? I you? used to get pissed off about it. What did? What did? What did and he, he would he would say the same shit. It's hard to. It's not that fucking hard to aim. You've been doing this for twenty eight fucking years. He would make excuses. Yes. <laughs> Little driplets on the floor and shit. <laughs> oh shit, my boy. <laughs> Say little driplets on the floor. <laughs> oh goodness. Just grab a mop. Fuck grabbing a mop. How about you just get it in the toilet? Okay, watch out, watch out. <laughs> okay, guys, I trying to bring this water to a boil. Actually, let me just use the fire back here. This might be faster. Alright. Oh, yeah, this is a lot of water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this can be faster, all right? Watch out. That shit's on, Shiloh. I know it's on. Shiloh. So Shiloh you don't want me, you want me to... Okay, hold on. Bam, bam. No, we Shiloh Buff was my um, celebrity crush growing up. Actually, we could, we, could, we could do it right here. It doesn't matter, okay? Now, guys, this is... Uh, my techniques might be a little controversial. So we come in with a little bit of salt in our water. What are, you, what are you bending back for? Because why are you, got, you getting the salt everywhere? Don't worry, homeboy. It's going in, okay? And then I come in with a little bit of olive oil, okay? Gordon Ramsay taught me this one. Oh, wow. Okay? Doesn't oil and water separate? Yeah, yeah. But what that oil does is it stops your pasta from sticking oh. together, okay? So you don't have strips stuck together. Well, it wouldn't be stuck together if the water was hot when you put the pasta in. No, no, no. They still could stick. Okay. Okay? They still could stick, okay? Smart ass. Okay. okay? They still could stick. Right. Um, Arkansas, so my grandmother had that uh, that saying. She had a, a, a yeah. Is that? A, a please, yeah, please be please. If you sprinkle while you tinkle, tinkle be a sweetie and wipe the seedy. If you flood a little more, please get up and wipe the floor. Oh, we didn't. I didn't say that. I said, if you tinkle when okay, if you if you sprinkle when you tinkle, please be neat and wipe the seat. Something like oh, that. Okay, I remember nice, that one. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> okay. Alice says her twelve year old doesn't miss. Yes, you are very blessed. You God, very hey, girls, blessed. would you like to be a guy just for like a week? See what it's like? If I was a guy for one day, I think I'd have the most fun ever. What would you do? 
The first thing I would do is wake up and then get bucket naked in the mirror and then do like this. What, so you could wave your balls? What happened? But, <laughs> you wait, but you want to play with balls? Like, what, what I'll you? just like swing it around the house <laughs> as I walk. Just <laughs> <swing>. <laughs> okay, wow. What? Wow, that, that's what she wants to do as a guy. That sounds like and so much fun. And then I'd find the hottest girl I could and try to smash just to see what it really feels like the to have a penis. What, the rejection? No, 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 no. I wouldn't get rejected. What the fuck make you think you wouldn't get rejected? Because look how cute I am as a girl. If I was a guy, I'd be the hottest thing out there. What are you talking about? Okay, but see, you got to understand, like, a lot of this is delusional, right? <laughs> like, you fucking out of your mind. See, when you were a guy, you in reality, Okay. <laughs> May your delulu come true, true. Okay. See, firstly, every woman is beautiful. Most guys are ugly. You understand that? See, no, okay. No, okay, firstly, if a woman's slim, oh my God, she's so slim and cute. If she's big, she's big and beautiful. You don't get that with a guy, okay? We just all, whatever. You just better hope you're tall enough. You, know? no, you, you just gotta, you just gotta have game. You know? If you were a girl, what would you do first thing when you wake up? Ah. Find my, find my G spot, write it down, take notes of where it is, and so I can find it when I turn back to a guy, okay? Because I need that fucking roadmap, okay? <laughs> Put a GPS track on that shit. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would do. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so that's what that's what the hell I would do. That's what, that's what the hell. I would do. Jelly McBread said, <laughs> Jelly My Bread said, what's happening? <laughs> By the way, speaking of Jelly, okay, Jelly Roll was Thanks in the news. Oh, uh, 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 who's that? Did, did he again? Did drunk, he? Drunk yeah. Emma now. Maybe it's how much I'm bringing to me. Asa. Yeah, so. <laughs> Is that Emma? Uh-uh. Oh. I don't know. It could be. I doubt it. I doubt it, though. But, um, but uh, Jelly Roll's in the news. Um, you know the musician, Jelly Roll? No. We have a picture of Jelly Roll somewhere, Stefan? Yeah, well, okay, so he he um he said he was he did a he did a talk show, and him and ah there he is, him and Diddy won the talk show at the same time, right? Mm -hmm. And you know like if me and you doing like the Tonight Show or some shit like that, there's a green room where like we could go and talk later and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Because there's mm -hmm. a room that you wait in before you go on. I'm waiting. This is and I feel like this is gonna be juicy. Jelly Roll and Jelly and, and Jelly Roll was like Diddy Diddy wanted to meet him, you know. And he was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's like halfway there. He was like, you know what? Fuck this. And left. But this was before all this shit happened. He oh. just like, he just like, he had a bad vibe about it. So who knows if he's oh. making that shit up. You know what I mean? But he, Probably he, did. Yeah. Probably would have got diddled in that green room. Nah, I, don't, I don't know. I don't think everybody is diddled. You know? I mean, like, I think, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, okay, let's be, let's be very clear with something. Regardless of what your sexuality is, you're not attracted to every fucking one. You know what I mean? That's okay, because like, that's true. like, that's true. Like, okay, so when when I when I came to when I came to America, my first job was at Starbucks, right? Mm -hmm. This Starbucks was you fucking neek. The Starbucks had okay. First, I coming from the Bahamas, which super fucking homophobic. Mm -hmm. The Starbucks has twenty three employees. Mm -hmm. Twenty of them were gay. Twenty of them were gay, right? And so in my mind, you know, Thanks, Pixie. you know, I'm you were the one of the three. That yeah, was yeah, it was just three of us who were straight, right? So in my mind, so I, was, I used to work this shift with my boy Javier, right? And I was like, I was talking to him, right? And I was like, Javi, you know, I know you won't buying me, dude. He's like, no, I don't. You're not my type, Scott. <laughs> you know? I mean, it really hurt my feelings, firstly. But then in that <laughs> moment, I realized as talking to him, like they're not attracted to, to everyone, everybody, you know what yeah. I mean? Because I'm pretty sure he wanted to smash me, but it turns out he didn't. You know what I mean? I'm not his type. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I learned that invaluable lesson. Yeah. <laughs> I, a, a lot of bisexual people say, like, just because I'm bi doesn't mean I want to smash Yeah, you, yeah, yeah. Like, they're not attracted to everyone. Yeah. They're specific guys that they're attracted to. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure Diddy has a type. You know what I mean? Yeah. And who knows? Diddy, Diddy might be only into, like, black dudes. You know what I mean? Black rapper oh, dudes. Oh, no. That little, that Justin Bieber clip was real questionable. Yeah, I mean, uh, oh, poor, poor Bieber. Wouldn't have, but someone like Bebo or Usher wouldn't come out and talk about this though, because I feel. Because yeah, I mean damn. it's traumatizing. You can yeah, dude, that would that would it's be traumatic to talk about. And Usher, come on now, like yeah, that'll be a little, that'll be a little, you not know. Not after his super successful re residency in Vegas. Yeah, like, he, he might. He doesn't want to come out. You don't. Like, yeah, you don't. You don't want to talk about that kind of shit, you know. And it's unfortunate that that happened, but this this is the way. Oh, Bambi. What's up, Bambi? What's up? What's up? 
I see you finally made it to the chat. Shell, as we wait for this water to boil since it's taken six years, would you like to do a shot? Yeah, let's do one. Okay, let's do a shot, but let's, let's try to find something, guys. Uh, guys, any short su suggestions? Short suggestions, Please okay? Please don't suggest anything gross, because I have to take it. Yo, G-Money in the house. Hey, G-Money. <laughs> Them waves looking real nice, G-Money. <laughs> you can tell Bieber has seen some shit. Absolutely. He don't look like how he used to. Who? He, he aged a lot. Who? Bieber. Hasn't he aged a lot? Yeah, but he had a medical issue. He had a he had a oh, situation. He had, yeah, he had a situation where his face was paralyzed, though. Yeah, poor guy. I'm yeah, his face okay. his face was paralyzed. Cerebral so. palsy. Or, that's yeah, what yeah, saying. cerebral palsy. I remember meeting. You remember the mountain from Game of Thrones? Yeah. So when I so I, I took a trip to where he's from, right? Is he like, did you meet him? Yeah, do like six nine or something like that. Mm, like Four hundred pounds. And we made, we made, um, we That's made, uh, we made a thingum together. We made a, uh, oh my God, we made a Bloody, uh, Bloody Mary together. And then part of it is I had to lift him, right? He wanted, I, he, I was like, cause like, we wanted to show how strong he was. So I was like, why don't you lift me? And then he's like, man, like I'm tired of lifting people. That's like so played, right? Then I'm like, okay, let me lift you. And dude, you I could couldn't? fuck no dude. The dude was over 400 pounds. <laughs> Dude was fucking huge. It's hilarious. And strong as fuck. I bet he has a really tiny wife too. He likes his girls are smaller. Yeah. That's so his, funny. His girls are smaller. That is let me, so let me, funny. Let me see if I can find it, okay? Arkansas says do a money shot. LOL. Is that a real shot? Steak shot. Because I'm just thinking about porno when you said that. Let me see. Game of Thrones, tipsy bartender. Bambi thinks he's fine. Who? The uh the mountain. The mountain? Bambi, you like redheads? You have a thing for gingers? Okay, hold on. Let me see. City boy, you don't like Bloody Marys? I love them if they're made right. If they're made right. Let me, let me see. Let me see. Um, Somebody said a pink Scooby snack. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Bloody Mary. I just searched for this video. You don't know how to make a Bloody Mary? No, not that one. The <laughs> one with me in the game, me in the mountain, dude. Mm -hmm. oh, let me see. How many Bloody Marys do you drink? Me? Okay. Only on the week, like only during. Hold on, hold on, hold on. See, switch. So he's the mountain. Dang. And so I'm gonna try to lift him. Look at how tiny you look compared to him. <laughs> I know, guys. It looked like we're about to make love, but I'm not trying. I'm, I'm straining. Okay, I had to change my drawers after that. Okay. I Let's miss when you. To wear your cargo pants. Huh? You should bring the car. You should bring the army pants back. No, 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 no. Those days are long behind no, us now, child. Oh, I like the army pants. That was a different time. That was a different time. And see, I strict with my outfits. It's only black. He used to always wear army pants. Yeah, yeah, all yeah. The time. I go, I go through different phases. Okay, this is the phase of no army pants. Okay, what was the shot y'all wanted? Okay. Somebody said a pink Scooby snack. A pink Scooby snack. Okay, we could do oh, a money shot. Oh, that sounds interesting. I bought pink Scooby. So we have two. Okay, pink Scooby snack it is. Pink okay, Scooby. I just did a pink Scooby snack the other day on, on camera. Oh. Hold on, no, but we could do it. What's hold a on. money shot? Okay, hold on. This is a pink Scooby snack. Let's check this out. All right, guys. So let's look at this now. Hey, Boy said you was humping his leg. Yeah, I was humping his leg. <laughs> okay. I probably could have picked See, but the pink Scooby snack, though, I use pink pineapple. So I had pink pineapple juice, you see? So I won't have pink pineapple juice this time. So the only way I could get that is food coloring. So that's not, that's not a great pick. No, I was talking about Justin oh, Bieber. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? What? I thought she was talking about the mountain, but she was talking about Justin Bieber. Saying what? Saying what? Chat, Bammy. Thanks for the super chat. Sorry for the confusion. Okay, hold on now. So what are we doing short wise? <laughs> Somebody said Long Island iced tea shot. Okay, you want a Long Island iced tea shot? I mean, that that is doable, guys. You can do it. Somebody a, said, make her the Almighty Dragon. What the hell is a fucking Almighty okay. Dragon? There's a shot called a Seven Headed Dragon that has seven different alcohols in it. I'm not gonna give you that because you ain't gonna drink it. I'd rather gonna... do the uh, Long Island iced tea. Okay, shot. so let's do a Long Island iced tea shot. Okay, we have a glass here. This is our mixing glass. This clean. <coughs> you might want to just rinse it real quick. Okay, all right. So let's put let's put that on the side. Okay. Ow. It's okay, I got it. I'm not gonna burn myself, don't worry. <laughs> Mommy! Okay. Vodka, rum, gin, tequila. Vodka, rum. Gin, tequila, triple sec. Gin, tequila. Triple sec. 
Arkansas, uh, Arkansas has a Superman shot recipe. Oh, nice. I don't know if you want to see can that. Do that. Superman later. cherry liqueur. I don't know if I have cherry liqueur. Banana liqueur. What's a water moccasin? UV. Oh, that's a water moccasin is a shot too. That was a popular shot Shark back bite? in the day. Never heard of that one. Purple gecko. Superman shot. Water moccasin. Can I go pee really quick? Do I have time? Oh my God. It's okay. Take two seconds. How old are you, man? How old are you? I, I forgot to pee before the stream today. What if you pee in the pot? No, because that's going to taint the, the pasta. I give you $100 you pee in the pot. Heavy you nah. Okay, cool. I'll be right back. Just throwing it out there, guys. Just trying to give you all some content. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this, so, okay, hold on. Let me tell you what in a water moccasin. I haven't made one of those in a long time, but I know that was a popular shot at one point. I remember making that at the bar back in the day. Water moccasin shot. Kareem has a good point. What? Cover the pot, it will boil faster. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Kareem. Sorry, Kareem. <laughs> Kareem, we're going through a lot. Okay. Usman from Australia in the house. Hey, Australia. So this one, this, this recipe for this water moccasin is peach snaps, crown royal whiskey, triple sec, sour mix. Okay, okay. All right, peach snaps with crown royal. Peach snaps, crown royal. Okay. All right. Let me see if there's any other recipes for it. Water moccasin shot. Okay, we can do water moccasin later today. Let me see what else. Ryan, <laughs> Shayna's going to be back in one second. Okay. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> And yes, guys, read what Arkansas says. Please become a member and support our channel. I'm yes. going to post the link really quick. Yes, whiskey, peach snaps. Hey, Sheila. Yeah. Grab me Crown Royal from downstairs. Regular Crown, not one of the flavored ones, okay? Wait, Crown Royal? Crown Royal. The, actually, actually, bring me the peach one. Peach, peach Royal? Peach Crown Royal, okay? okay. So, guys, we can put a twist on this. We can do a peach... Okay, we can do the Long Island shot later. Okay, let's try this peach water moccasin, okay? This one, this one, this one's interesting. And this one we made so far. We have a, we have a, um, we have a tequila sunrise mimosa, those of you just joining us. We have a glittery pink lemonade. This is the Lexi. And then we have our mini banana watermelon, I mean mini watermelon punch thingy in a watermelon, whatever. Okay, you got it, Shayla? Okay, let's go. <clears throat> we got a super chat from David. David, what's up, homeboy? I thought we couldn't get any more ratchet than Sky to be in the boss guy. <laughs> <laughs> David, what I was looking at, right, is I watch Bear Grylls, and I know that urine, when it leaves the human body, is sterile, okay? So you can use it to drink in crisis situations. So what I was looking to do was create some crisis food, okay, with a little urine in it. But she was like, no, I'm not doing that. I'm too classy, okay? That pasta would have gave you all some energy because that urine was straight up Celsius. Really? <laughs> Probably. Was it the wrong color? What color was it? I mean, you have blue toilets, so I don't know. True. Yeah. His toilet water is blue. Cool. Okay, listen, grab peach snaps, please. So he can't tell how dehydrated Grab peach snaps and grab the sweet and sour for me. A uh, homemade sweet and sour. Yeah, okay, let me look at this. <laughs> Somebody's saying Shayla sending pics to her date. <laughs> what am I doing? You were just sending pics to your date later. <laughs> oh, really? Shayla, you all been exchanging pics? What? No, we haven't been exchanging pics. You sure? Um, what am I, in high school? You sure? Okay, this, this drink is a little weird because this has peach snaps and... And um, peach snaps and triple sec in it, you know, the water moccasin. And I'm looking at multiple recipes for this and noticing that trend, that it has both of those in it. No, I didn't get fired, Ryan. Why would you think that? Okay, Sheila, give me an ice cube, please. Whiskey, Oh peach my snaps. gosh, Iron Fan, stop busting my business out like that. What Iron Fan's in? What happened? What you want from here? Ice? Yeah, give me an ice cube. <laughs> so Iron Fan is like literally informing everybody. What, Iron Fan hit it? <laughs> Iron, you smashed this? Jesus. No. He's telling everybody about my date tonight. Could you stop sleeping with the fans of the show, please? 
Actually, guys, that's the service we used to provide. If you become a member. LOL, shut up. You get a little slice. Okay, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> peach crown rum shot is supposed to take like peach cobbler. Like a peach cobbler. What? We what? should try. We should try that. A okay. peach cobbler shot. And rum chata. Okay. All right. Rum okay. Focus on this. Okay. Um, pour spots, pour for Why'd you throw that pour spot like that? I didn't throw it at you. Did I throw it at you? I kind of meant to throw it at you. Just didn't happen that way. Hey, hurry up and boil, man! Fuck. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, guys. You got to talk to your food sometimes, okay? <laughs> Instantly starts boiling because it's scared. <laughs> if I scare the shit out of it, you know what I mean? You know? Come on, motherfucker. What? Okay? You see what I'm saying? I just noticed more smoke. All right. So, guys. This is a water moccasin with a twist. So, a water moccasin is crown, regular crown, okay? Peach snaps, triple sec, sweet and sour. That's our homemade sweet and sour. We made some more yesterday. So what I did to put a little twist on this now is I'm gonna I'm using peach crown. So let's see if this works, okay? So Shayla, let's go in. Let's hit me with about an ounce of that, okay? One ounce. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Okay, that's good. That's good. Now let's hit me with like you know like a half ounce of, of triple sec. One, two. Okay, and same thing with peach snaps. One, two. Okay, and then maybe a, a little, but the same thing with the sweet and sour. Maybe a little bit more. One, two. A little bit more, a little bit more splash. There's a little, um. Okay, that's good. Lemon, um. What, seed? Seed, yeah. seed? You scare the seeds in. Do seeds tend to scare you? Oh, oh my boy. gosh, you guys. What? You should have never told these people about this date. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Look, you all saw cog blocking, okay? That dude's he's, been working he's going out. He's to bridge press you tonight and wake up with a story to tell. I uh, cannot deal with y'all. Okay, hold on. Firstly, you said y'all No know, pressure. You, you said y'all have known each other for five years, right? Yes. So explain that. How does that work? Hmm? You all live in the same building. But you we don't live in the same building. Oh, this is not a dude you know from the same building. I thought this was a dude who was working out in your building. I don't work out in my building. I go to LA Fitness. Oh, this is a dude from the gym. From the gym. Oh, I thought the, I thought you went downstairs in your apartment or something out of gym. God, no, no, not the neighbor. Don't smash the neighbor. I highly do not recommend. We've done it before. No, but it just I can just that's messy written all over it. Oh it's boy. like smashing a coworker. Life short, smash a neighbor and a coworker. <laughs> Probably the same fucking time, okay? So you could have a story to tell, okay? I you know what I mean? <laughs> If you end up going to hell, you need to be able to say, boy, you know, I had fun getting here, okay? I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You guys, I do not want to get my hopes up about this date because I really like him, so I don't want to get my hopes up, okay? So we're not going to put pressure on the situation. You're not going to make me more nervous than I already am. Uh -huh. What if you get stood up? You can tell us? Yeah, I'll tell you guys. I'm not ashamed. Okay. But can you knock on wood right now? Because I really don't want that to happen. I kind of feel you can get stood up. Thank you, Stefan. I kind of feel she gets stood up. Don't say that, Scott. Homeboy, this dude's going to flake. If I get stood up tonight, I'm calling you and I'm going to curse you out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and why are you cursing? I can be laughing my ass off. Just know that. Okay. <laughs> Where's my strainer? Can't find it. Give me that glass, okay? Guys, I'm looking for my strainer, but I don't see it. So this is another way to strain. You put the glass back in, okay? The whole of the ice in. Oh. And then you could do that, okay? All right. Is that sanitary? Huh? You never seen this done before? No, not like that. Jesus, where you bartend? Never mind. <laughs> we, we usually have strainers where I bartend. Okay, well, hey, this tipsy mm. bartender, we can do it any way we want. And there you have it, homeboy! The peach no one. Bug. That wasn't a bug. That was not a bug. <laughs> why, is, <laughs> why is everything with you a bug? I saw some little, uh, little black things No, in because, there. It's all, listen, listen, this is an active environment where shit happens, okay? You have crumbs all over your face. I've been eating some shit, okay? Okay. Guess what I've been eating? Emma? <laughs> no, no, actually, I haven't. Okay? What was that reaction? Just drink the damn thing, man. I made him nervous. I was implying shit. Why are you shaking? What happened? You fucking old? No, hold it, hold it there, hold it there, guys. Look at the hand. Okay? Because <laughs> y'all got me nervous. She Put me in the hot seat. Damn. Okay. Michael J. Fox said he didn't that. Okay. Ooh. You like it? Ooh, yeah. Okay, well, let me write this one down now. Okay. 
because he wants an update to Bob. I'll give you guys an update. Okay, let me write this one down. So please, please pray that I don't get stood up tonight because I'll be sad. Peach Water Marcuson. This isn't our first time hanging out, though. This is actually our second time hanging yeah, out. Yeah, you so. didn't see this earlier. Ryan said that. Okay. You ain't got nothing to be nervous about. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. So what is this called again? This is really good. This shit is so... This, is, this will be a really good cocktail, too. What, what, like what is summer? it called, though? Um, this is a peach water moccasin. Peach water moccasin. I like it. Yeah. I like it. It's really good. I just writing down the recipe. Peach schnapps. Thank you, Alice. Thank you, Alice. What? Thank you, G Money. Thank you. Thank you, guys. I really appreciate all the support. Even though I'm a nervous Nelly right now. Thank you all. How about I this day? Appreciate it. Why are you nervous though? I mean, what's gonna happen? You know what I mean? Like, my boy's gonna hit it and then bounce and you know. You think that's what's gonna happen? You could, I'm gonna spill the tea to all the tipsy. I'll give you guys all the details tomorrow. Okay, let's put this. Let's put these bottles behind us. Even if he smashes, I'll give you guys the tea. Are you gonna tell us? <laughs> I'll tell you guys. Oh shit! I told Stefan. Stefan, he kissed me last time. So. Oh, he kissed you last time? Oh shit! At the gym? No, not at the fucking gym. You already went out? We hung out once before already. Yeah. Oh, what, okay. Hold on, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on. Let me size this, this up. This is the second time. Okay, so what did y'all do the first time? We watched anime. We, it wasn't anything crazy. We just watched anime. So y'all had like a little Netflix and chill? Yeah, yeah. Because he's like, he's introduced me to some of his favorite shows. So we've been watching them together. So y'all sitting on the couch. He kissed me. And that That's was it? it. Relax. He ain't try to touch nothing? Damn. I can't with He ain't Sky. try to touch nothing? Sky, leave it alone. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Sky, he's very respectful. How long ago was this? Mm, last week, I think, or okay. maybe the week before or something like that. Was he's it? traveling for work a lot, so it could have been like two So you all on the couch watching anime. He leads in for the kiss. Nothing happened but the kiss. Okay, but Can why did why did he try to? I mean, he knew that I was on my period. Okay, see that I knew there was something messing it up because my boy should have smashed, okay? <laughs> I knew, I knew. Because if y'all remember, last week, that's why I asked her how long ago, right? Because last week she was in here, but she cramping and shit like that. Oh boy, you should have asked her before you invited her over. You should have been like, hey, um. Sky, stop. You're making me shy. I don't like this. You know? Only reason my boy ain't score is because the thing was on. Anime is life. Anime is life. You know what I mean? Anime is life. <laughs> I love anime. You know? The only reason my boy ain't get lucky is because of, you know, damn. Okay? That is, that is freaking crazy. Oh, I just realized, Sheila, we got to we gotta cut some chicken, too. All right, hold Ooh, tight now. Ooh, this is some chicken lasagna we making? There's chicken in this, We're you know what I mean? We're making a real ass meal today, y'all. There's chicken in this one, boy. There's chicken in this. Where's my... Welcome back, Adrian. Where's my chicken? Okay. So we could be working on this, okay? So you approve, so you like this one. This is fire. It smells good, though. It's fire. Jesus Christ, you smell that? It smells, it smells like peaches. Down, down. Like a Georgia Can't peach. do it, can't do it, homeboy, can't do it, okay? A Georgia peach. Once I go down that road, there's no coming back. Actually, if I start drinking right now, I'll drink every day for like a couple of days, then I can be like, ugh, I don't like it anymore. You know, I'm petty like that. DJ Bozak, DJ Bozak is such a hater, bro. What are you DJ doing? DJ Bozak, why do you hate me so much? He ain't trying to hate what you. What did I ever do to you? He isn't hating. That's a guy's flirt. Okay. It's not fourth graders flirt. Huh? It's there's, a, a, there's a guy in the fourth grade who used to pull my hair all the time mm -hmm. and kind of bully me a little bit. Mm -hmm. And uh, every time I would complain to it about the teachers, they would be like, oh, but he likes you. Mm -hmm. That's just what boys do when they like you. And how'd that make you feel? Abuse? Mm -hmm. That's what y'all do? Guys have weird ways of showing they like you, especially when they're young. They do dumb shit, you know what I mean? Hey, Shayla, watch me. Watch me jump off the table. Ah! Okay, and then, you know. I'm like my brother when he jumped off the balcony and broke both of his feet. <laughs> he was trying to impress a girl? Yes. <laughs> who's, the, who's the girl he was trying to impress? She was a really, I mean, she was super cute. So, like, but, like, don't jump off it a damn Orsa. balcony. Did she date him? They were together. Damn. I think she was already his girlfriend. What happened after <laughs> Dumbass. that? Dumbass. What happened after he that? He jumped off the balcony and broke both of his feet. Is your brother the player? And then crawled up the stairs, crying, <laughs> crying. And 
mean he had to wear casts on both of his feet for the whole summer. Is, and is, I had to fucking take care of him and make him ramen noodles and shit because he, he couldn't get around the house. Is your brother a player? No, he's actually a very, very respectful young man. He's a, he's a saved Christian man. Really? Mm-hmm. Very, very This is the same one who got beat up by the girl, by the girl with the boxer? No, 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 that's my younger brother. My older brother, he was in the army mm-hmm. for a while. And, and, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the younger brother, is he a player? <laughs> he could be, I don't know, probably, honestly. What do you mean, honestly? I could see him being a player. Does he try to holler at your girlfriends? Huh? Does he try to holler at your girlfriends? Surprisingly not. But, I, but my girlfriends are older than he is, you know? He's only like 20. And you probably have a bunch of ugly friends, right? My Just friends are so cute. Don't even <laughs> try to come at me crazy. You sure? My friends are super cute. The ones I've seen? <laughs> I can't, I can't share his friends. Y'all are very, very cute, I'm sure. <laughs> Which is what dudes say. Jelly, my bread, said he fell for her. Yes, literally. Literally fell. He fell for her. Literally it. jumped. Okay, Shayla, do me a favor. Grab me, um, grab me a bowl for me to drop these in. All right. Did you rinse that chicken off, homeboy? Yeah. This chicken is 100% clean. Okay. Come on, homeboy. We're almost there. Okay. I mean, that's... Hey, Stiffy. St- hey, Stiffy. It wasn't even two stories, Leonard. It was like fucking four stories high. Like, come on now. You think you're going to land that? <laughs> Stick that landing? Shit was wild. Okay. I was in there making burgers. Okay, how's that look? Is that enough chicken? What do you think? I think that's good. Hmm? There's only two of us. Okay, fine. You don't even know what I'm making. You run I don't. Your I don't. Okay. This the I last time you said you weren't going to make things so big, you know? Yeah, okay. So listen, grab me, grab the seasonings that you would want to put in there. Okay. Nice. My favorite part. I can let I can let Shayla do the seasoning today. All right. <clears throat> Welcome to the membership. Hey, so so you all know my boy who's the new James Bond, right? His name is Aaron Taylor Johnson. So um, he's thirty three. His wife is like fifty seven or some shit like that. Anyway, there's a twenty something year age difference. Actually, when they started dating. Um, he was he was 19 and she was 42. Okay. This one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so that's them in the beginning. Okay, they're still together. Oh, they're cute. He's been dating her since he was since, since he was like 18, so 19. So he must really love her. Yeah, 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 yeah. And she's you know, and this is this is unique because um, it's unique because usually it's the other way around. It'll be the old dude and the, and the younger girl, yeah. you know. But this is one of those where and that's like Jason Momoa and Lisa Bonnet. Bon- yeah, and he's their age difference isn't as big as this though, right? No. And he's the new James Bond, nice. you know. But his wife was saying she gets uncomfortable that people focus so much on their on their, uh, age, on their age age difference, you know. I mean, she's gonna have to get over that though. But she started buying to do when he's fucking 19, 18, 19. Like, what do you expect? And it's like, okay, it's and like, she was at, she was at least 41, 42 years old. Do you think that's predator behavior right now? He was legal, Anything and he's a dude, goes. and dudes naturally horny, so they can take it. I mean, and he's still with us, so I mean, that's that's true love. They last longer than everybody else. How you know? long is he? How old is he now? He's 33 now. They have kids and shit. Oh, wow. <laughs> they have kids and shit, you know? So, so I mean, I don't, I don't know. Guys, look here. Look, look. If you have a huge age difference, people can be talking shit. You know what I mean? But look at Cher. Cher's... Her boyfriend is hella young, right? Cher's 70-something and her boyfriend's like 38. You know what I mean? So you, ju- you just do oh, it. Oh, he's older, old enough, though. I thought he was younger than that. No, I think he's like 38, right? Okay. 30 well, something, anyway. In you his know? 30s? In his late 30s? Yeah. Seven. Shayla, I have a comeback for you. Ask guy how many pills do he take before sex because you know he old. Well, firstly, old lady gaming, if you must know. Did okay? you ever overdose on Viagra? I've never overdosed on Viagra, okay? He's lying. He was just at the hospital last Never night. Never overdosed on Viagra. But I do travel with two Viagra in my back pocket really? and an old condom just in case it's apocalypse and I got to come out fighting. Okay? I need to be able to bang the enemy. Okay? Step out, homeboy. Step out. You know what I mean? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Emma, I'm joking. I don't have any Viagra in my wallet. <laughs> Emma's like, shut the fuck up, Sky. <laughs> <laughs> As I talk, Emma's just sitting there like this. 
<laughs> okay, homeboy, we got a boil. We got a boil, okay? Check this boil out. All right? Look at that homeboy. Boil. We are the boil, okay? Oh, Sheila. Boiling. Let's get our lasagna. And let's slip it in. I'm sliding in my lasagna. Okay. So guys, you want lasagna strips, okay? Check it out. Okay? It's high grade stuff. This is stuff El Chapo used to sell back in the day. Okay? High grade lasagna. All right. El Chapo. Now we don't need much of this, you know? But why would I keep a ton? Well, let's see, let's see, let's see what we need. Oh yeah. Alice said you won't need Viagra with her. Who? What that mean, Alice? Who? You got the goods? Excuse me, who was that? Alice. <laughs> Alice Olivia down. I see, I see her. Alice, what the hell does that mean, Alice? <laughs> I mean, she gonna turn you on. Uh, Alice, Alice is trouble. I mean, she got that foreplay action. Alice is trouble, okay? Did you turn the water down? No, I didn't touch okay, it. Okay, good, 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 good. So we, we get we get our band together. Oh, yeah. We getting it together, homeboy. <clears throat> thank you, all of the subscribers. Ah, uh, yay. Hey, there's a lot. Of, okay, thank you, Matt. Thank you, thank you all for, for coming through and supporting us in our dumb shit. You know what I mean? We need you. <laughs> This stupid show needs your support, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Y'all are the only people who watch this, and we thank you for that, okay? <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, dude, okay, so the minimum wage in California is now what? $20 if you work at McDonald's. You heard that? Only McDonald's? We're fast food workers. At, at, hold on, at locations that have more than a certain number of... of um, Employees? No, more than a certain number of locations. Uh, uh, only at only at places that have numerous. So if you're a small business I operator, I thought my paycheck is about to go up. If you if you're a small business operator and you only have one location, they, they don't make you pay that because that's that's um that's a pretty high minimum wage, right? Nice so twenty. Nice so anyway, there's a special in McDonald's. I mean, there's a Mac, the McDonald's special where you where um you are. I think you get forty nuggets and two large fries. Okay. Is. $25 here in California, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh -huh. And in other states, it's significantly cheaper because they don't have that, that you know, that, um, they don't have the yeah, kind of minimum, minimum wage. Yeah, they don't have the minimum wage thing that we have, you know? So McDonald's is more expensive here? Yeah, McDonald's is more expensive here, but then, the, see, but dudes, they are, ah. See, I don't, I don't know. California is an expensive state, though. Yeah. Because there were some people complaining about the price. Like, why is that special here, $25? But, I mean, it's Cali. Cali ain't a cheap state, man. This, uh, Their rent is higher, so damn, they got to make the money back somehow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, stuff in Cali is expensive. I don't agree with everything that's going on in Cali, though, because Cali has some weird rules. But then the thing is, you go to other states, and you all got other weird shit, too. Like, look what's going on in Arizona right now. You all flipping out down there, you know what I mean? So it really, it really depends. Mm-hmm. You know, really depends. Come on, homeboy, back over there. Keep doing our thing. Okay. So that's the seasoning for this. Oh yeah, it's You're nice sure? and seasoned up. Mm-hmm. You sure this is what you want? Yep. Okay. Put some Cajun, some smoked paprika. Okay, we need to fry this up. So let's grab another pan. Okay. I don't think they need to see us cook this one. You don't want to put the big old hot plate thing right here. What thing? Oh, you mean the grill? The griddle? Get it. Get the griddle then. You got, the hell okay. is this? Come oh. over here. Come over here and I, I, I'll get it. Okay? <laughs> you hold forth. Okay? Tell old lady game and stop making fun of me. Shayla, hey, Shayla, do you remember Steve Harvey 90 Day Rule? Oh, I should you think should, about it tonight. What? That you shouldn't give a guy it before 90 days? Yeah, before 90 days of dating, I guess. Who the fuck waiting 90 days? <laughs> I'm sorry. Who is this guy? Moses? Huh? Christopher fucking Columbus? Who's supposed to wait 90 he might days? He respect me more if I make him wait. He can die at old age. 90 days? Get, okay, I'm going to be honest with y'all right now. Go get the griddle. Okay, go ahead. What I'm going to be say? honest with y'all right now, okay? I don't know. I, it's been a while since I've gotten any, if you know what I mean. And your girl's been horny, okay? So look, if he tries to put it on me tonight, 
I would say it's about 80, 20% chance. 20% chance I'm, I say no, 80% chance I say yes. So. Okay, guys, in the comments, Both. one of you know this dude, okay? One of you know Nobody the dude she's him. talking about. Please call him up and tell him tonight it's the night. Go in strong. Shut up. Go in strong, okay? That's crazy. Tonight, Shayla is smashing you. Okay, yeah, plug that in somewhere. You know, tonight is the night, homeboy. Okay, let me look at this now. Let me look at my little... I think it still needs time. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little, little bit more, a little bit more. A little bit more. Somewhere there's an Italian watching us going, what the fuck? <laughs> you like that spray? There's an Italian, why? Because you can't boil pasta? No, I'm just saying. They probably have an issue with the oil in there, the salt, uh, the everything, you know what I mean? Like, oh my God, you guys are destroying yeah. it. Mon ami, the money, why? I want to go to Italy. Really? Maybe this yeah. dude will take you. What does he do for a living? He's an actor. Oh, shit. So he ain't got no money then? He has money. He has a house and everything. He's a working actor. Very, what? very booked. Very booked. Really? What is he working on right now? Very booked. Why would I tell you what he's working on? <laughs> Just asking you what show is he on right now? I'm not going to tell you what show he's on right now. It's none of your business. Is he a regular on the show? Yes, he's, he's done several shows. I ask you, I've done several shows. That'll make me a and regular. And he was a regular, yes. On, on the, all the shows that he's been on, he's really good at what he okay, does. Okay, don't worry, Shayla. Okay, okay, cool, <laughs> cool, cool, guys, cool, guys. Let's, Sorry. Yes, Shayla's going through can a lot we, right now. Yeah, we don't have to talk about it anymore. No, we can talk about him. Let's keep lighting his ass up. Steven, thank you for not thinking less of me. You know, a girl's got to get some, too. By the way, you guys been watching this girl. Okay, so there's this woman. Her husband walked out on her, Aww. okay, and left her with two kids. Oh, God. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Firstly, they had two kids, okay. She was, she was pregnant with the second one he left, okay, when he left. The first one was only like a year or two old, okay? Okay. And the dude just bounced, all right? So the second one he's never even met because he wasn't there. Mm -hmm. And so she put out a notice on, folks, on Facebook. Going to fry this now, guys. She put out a notice on Facebook. <laughs> trying to find the dude, you know, saying, hey, because she's missing. Well, like he's missing person's report. <laughs> yeah, kind of, because she won't get divorced from him, you see, and she oh. couldn't find him. So he just literally just disappeared. She posts his picture. Stephen, you found a picture of that guy. Um, he's um, he uh, her name is Ashley, yeah, like Maguire or something. Like, see, look, look, turn look. This up, dude. OK, but look, 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 look. So that's the two of them when it was going good. OK. And then this dude disappeared. That sucks. And the whole fucking internet came for this guy. You know what I mean? Oh, you this, you that. You see what I'm saying? Because well, she, she posted it and it went viral. Because he left her with two kids. Yeah. And he, no explanation. He posted it. It went viral, right? So, <laughs> Shayla's new bow is <laughs> more <laughs> We're going to have to. <laughs> and he has two Emmys. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, that Emmy joke is a call back to, to some girl who was telling Shayla she has two Emmys. Because okay. I touched her. She said, don't touch me. I have two Emmys. That's you still, know what I wanted to do? That's still bother. Have you seen her since? No, I haven't seen her. Fuck that bitch. If I see her, she can catch these hands. <laughs> is she friends with one of your friends? Yep, and I told my friend, don't bring her around. Do not bring her around me ever again in life. Okay. Damn, you're you fucking cold. Because like. how dare you think you're better than me because you have some fucking Emmys. I'm not going to give a shit about your Emmys. This is, is this not on? hot. Did this shot out or something? Come on. I think it might have. Did it cut off? off? Did it? Oh. oh, it wasn't on. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> it was on, but then, but then a, a particular person oh hit God. the draw, causing it to cut off, okay? My bad, y'all. Yeah, it is your bad, punk. Okay. All right, guys, we, we're, we're, we're making progress. I'm sorry, guys. We're going through a lot here, okay? When I work with Shelly, you know, it takes patience. <laughs> Shelly's, Shelly's all about patience. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, so going back to that thing, that, that um, Ashley McGuire thing, put, put the picture back up again for me. So, the husband leaves. Lord Tachuka said it's legal to be nude. Where? On YouTube. Really? So really? he wants us to do a nude show. Really, Lord Tachanka? <laughs> really? <laughs> it's legal to be nude, okay? <laughs> you taking his word for it or you can ask you too? <laughs> okay. 
Lord Chucky trying to get us canceled. Anyway, she started looking for the dude. The shit went viral. And so everybody knows this story now. So whatever girl he was lying to about his family, she fucking knows now. You know what I mean? Ugh. Crazy out there. It's crazy out there, right? But that's the thing. Men can do shit like that. Like, like what? Just leave? Just get up. Just get up and leave, and act like you didn't give birth to two kids. Women could do that too. There are women who I feel walk. Like women have more moral responsibility because they push that thing Dude, out. Dude, I know. I know several women who fucking walked out. Okay. On the kids? Yeah. Yeah, and gone off and start new fucking families. Women. Yes. Because that's such a man. Not thing a, not to as do. not as often as dudes do it. Dudes yeah. do it on the regular, but women do it as well. Okay. You know, every everybody does some dumb shit here and there. Okay, is this fucking thing on? It's, it's on. It's on. It's on. It's just taking a little bit to warm up. I think. Is it though? What the fuck? It stopped boiling. I don't trust this thing. Okay, hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, is that on? It looks like it's on. It's on. It's on. This, yeah, the light's on. Okay. Okay. But stay on that side so you don't touch anything over here because you're the one who was hitting this in the first place. Okay. There we go. My shit's boiling. Good. All right. Bigger Bonnet said a new family is wild, right? Like, what the? Dude, a lot of dudes go start new families, you know. My uncle did that. What? How many kids he left behind? Three, and then got three new ones. And guess what? What? All six of his kids are girls. That's what the fuck you get. All six of his kids are girls? Mm-hmm. I'm sure he wanted a son. Okay, but with the new, which one, which one, does he take care of the kids that he left? Yeah, I mean, like, he wasn't, like, an absentee father. He was definitely there for, his, for both families. It's not like he just ran away completely and never talked to them again. He was just, well, that's not, that, that don't count then. Yeah, but he still left and, and started a new family, and it made my cousins feel sad. They're like, why isn't our family good enough? You know? There's a lot of trauma that goes into that. Cool, cool, cool. I hear that. What the fuck is going on with this thing, man? Actually, guys, let's just throw this on the stove behind us. That's okay? what I'm saying. Like, it keeps turning off. Yeah, pull that, pull that, turn that shit off. Because I don't feel I don't feel that extension cord is good. Yeah, it must not be. Plug it directly in. Okay. Plug it. Oh yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Plug gotcha, that. Gotcha. Plug that directly into the wall. Yes. Okay. Yes. Now we cook it with gas. This this shit's gotta go. This one isn't working anymore. It had its time. It's it's now done. Okay. I've lived so many places I can claim no place and no place can claim me, but I've always loved Midwest. I like the Midwest too. And Louisiana Pride, that's what he said? Mm-hmm. Wisconsinite right here, y'all. Okay, let's put this on the side. All right, guys. Ooh, now it's sizzling. Y'all hear that? Okay, now we sizzle. It's that extension cord, guys. That going through some shit, you know what I mean? Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Been in the family a long time, you know? Do you want to apologize then now for, for what? blaming it on me? You were standing here. Oh, okay. Okay? If you stand close to it, it's your fault. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but what's going on with you guys? How is life treating you guys? Oh, Big Chubby said they should be al dente. Because, yeah, you do have to put it back in the oven. He said don't boil the noodles for too long. No, no, I'm not going to them, boil them for too long. But it wasn't working right, so so it, it wasn't properly done. You know what I mean? So yeah. I'm not his name is also Big C Buggy, not Big Chubby. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so it wasn't so it, it wasn't actually cooking properly because the thing was on and off, on and off, on and off. You know what I mean? My bad, Big C. <laughs> <laughs> My eyes be playing tricks on me sometimes. You know. Oh yeah, look at this, oh boy. They're asking if this is your cute outfit for the day tonight. Yeah, what happened? What you no, wear tonight? No, I'm not gonna wear this. Okay, hold on, let's go back to this 90 day rule. Let's discuss this 90 day rule. Cause I'm not sure that's Has effective. Has anybody ever made you wait 90 days? Who the fuck waiting 90 days, huh? That's just three months. Three fucking months? It takes a while to get to know somebody. I don't think so, dude. I think you click really early on, okay? <laughs> not no three months. So do you think that's like too old school? Like That's too long in today's but, but world. I feel like guys back in the day used to really respect that. No, hell no, boy. Your granddaddy was smashing day one. <laughs> they just act like they weren't, you know? You know what? Our grandparents did have hella kids. Yeah. Hella kids. They were straight hoes back in the day, but they tried to act like I it was I know, right? Up. My grandma has like 15 brothers and sisters. Yeah. 
My mom has, my mom was like one of 11. My dad was one of a billion, okay? He didn't even know how many of the fucking them it was, you know? And now people aren't having kids at all. Y yeah, it, it just reversed. Yeah, the planet, the planet, um, all populations crashing. China, India, everywhere, they, they're producing a little less. This chicken is looking and smelling delicious. Oh boy, this, this, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I do, okay? I do chicken. Shayla can show up the date smelling like licking chicken. No, I'm going to take a shower first. <laughs> Are you going to shave? What? Are you shaving? No. Thank you, what? <laughs> I got a Brazilian wax today. <laughs> For real? Oh, she prepped. She prepped, oh boy. She prepped. Oh my God. She prepped for this shit. Shut up. Okay? <laughs> Fucking 90 days. Huh? It doesn't look like 90 day fiance. That shit's too long. Oh, this looks great though. I think it might be done, Sky. Yeah. You don't want to overcook the chicken. No, no, no. We can, solve, we can solve. We can solve. We can solve it. It's not going to be an oven long anyway. Okay, but should we put it in a bowl or something? Yeah, let's put it in a bowl. Okay, so so grab a bowl for me, please. Okay, we can turn this off too. We got that. All right. Yeah. Scoop it in. All right. And guys, I go in to drain my pasta. So our pastry chef says, I'm not waiting 90 days to smash. Screw that. I'd rather find someone that yeah, wants me, yeah, to dude. smash. What yeah. if you really like her, though, pastry Thanks chef? Thanks for the super that's, that's so long, What though. if she has the best personality of anybody you've ever met in okay, your but entire see, life? Okay, suppose yeah, but that, that, that already doesn't go together. Suppose you wait 90 days, right? And then you fucking just don't like any aspect of that. You just blow, you know, a quarter of a year. Red, you good? You just blew out. You just blew. You just blew. You know, a quarter of the year. You know what I mean? Yeah, a, yeah. Like that's a long time, man. Oh Ooh. yeah. That is a hell of a long time. What am I doing? You, you know, he met my ex-boyfriend once. They're friends? No. Mm -mm. But there was an event that my friend threw, and so I invited my boyfriend at the time, which is not my ex. And we were all sitting at a dinner table together. And this dude and your ex. Yeah, and this dude is like very confrontational. He's like Who? This dude? The current dude? Yeah. That you going on a date with? He's like not scared of a challenge. He's like, you know, he's like he likes to push people's buttons to see. Okay. Like, you know? So me my ex it was him, my ex, and then I'm sitting right here, right? And it's time for dessert. And you know what? He, the, the, the waitress comes out and she's like, would you guys like any dessert? And you know what he said to my ex? What? He pointed to my ex and he was like, he wants some peach cobbler. Just trying to be like testy, you know? You don't get it? No. There wasn't even peach cobbler on the menu. I get that, but why? I don't know, because he's just testy like that. And this is sexy to you? This and sounds so like my, a fucking psycho. And so my ex goes, get him some banana pudding. And they kind of like went at it for a second. And I, I jumped in and was like, because nah, I didn't want anybody to start fighting, you know? Okay, but what kind of dumb ass shit is that? And why you want to date this dude? Because that's a fucking problem. That right there is a red flag to me. Why is it a red flag? Because what the fuck you got to say something to this dude for? But you want some peach cobbler. Like, what the fuck? I think he was doing that on purpose to kind of like let him know that like, hey, you know, even though that's your girl, you know, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe Ooh. that's a dumb story to tell. No, 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 no. That's the perfect story to tell. <laughs> and that's a fucking red flag. It's a problem. <laughs> well, this was years and years ago. Does sure it he's fucking matter? What do you mean you sure you mature? What, 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 like how, how many years and what is 20 years ago? It was like three or four years ago. Three or four years ago. It doesn't matter. That's a problem. Oh, Sky, it's okay. It's Dude, fine. Dude, that's a red... Okay, how is that not a red flag? Don't burn the house down. How is that not a red flag, Thank Jayla? you so much, uh, Thanks Ryan. for the super chat, Ryan. How is that we not a red flag? We'll get a new extension cord. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Okay, Leave it alone. hold on. Let me, let, me, let, me get, let me get something. I thought it was funny. I don't, I don't see that as being funny. <laughs> Strong agrees it's a red flag. I don't see that as being funny at all. That's and a, so does Tachanka. That's a problem, dude. Like, what? fans who, like, literally everybody. In really? Here. Like, why the fuck he's saying something to your ex like that? And you're not, you know what I mean? And you with your ex, not with him. 
I know, right? I was like, wow, he's being testy today. Somebody's bold. What kind of weird shit is that to say, though? I know, right? But Where I think, you know I think, right? I think he was testing my ex's, like, manhood, you know, to see if he was going to rebuttal or, like, have something to say back, you know? Like, I think, okay. he, was, I think he was testing to see, like, what type of dudes do Shayla, like, Okay. Is, okay. He, is he brave enough to, like, say something back or, I don't know. But you, it was so long ago. Anybody think about Arkansas that? Even Arkansas agrees with, with Sky on this one. I don't know. Maybe I just like red flags. Is it hot? Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> and it's stuck together, so that oil didn't really do much. It's been sitting there, okay? Stuck together. <laughs> Mom. Sorry. Do you want help? <laughs> <laughs> I think I can handle I got it, it. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. You know women's fingers can handle yeah. heat. Okay, that's lay out three more. You can L- lay Walter them right Chaka on there. says literally everyone agrees with Sky. You gotta cancel the date. Oh no, I'm not canceling <laughs> the date, you guys. And I'm also not judging him for what he did three years ago. None of us are perfect. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Put it, put it on the side here. Okay, but Sheila, you sitting there with your fucking boyfriend, okay? Mm-hmm. This other dude. To show your boyfriend up says he wants some peach cobbler. <laughs> like, what kind of dumb shit is that? And you're like... You guys, don't be so harsh, though. It's okay. No, because they ain't idiots. They realize that there's a fucking problem. This dude was picking a fight with your boyfriend. He was picking a fight with your boyfriend. You do understand this. Well, they didn't fight. So. Of course, that they didn't fight, but it could have happened. This if, wasn't even that hot. Do you want me to lay out some more? No, that's good. If your boyfriend was a little bit different, guys, so this is uh, Alfredo sauce, you know, creamy Alfredo, whatever bullshit, okay? So we can pour a little bit of this in here. Do you know how to make Alfredo from scratch? It's really easy. Yeah, with a little bit of cream cheese and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, I don't think I've ever used cream cheese. Yeah, you could use cream cheese. DJ Bulls like, also has a good, a good one. What? What he said? <laughs> Red flags are green flags if you're just trying to smash, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm just I'm just saying like this. Well, I can, I can agree with you guys that it wasn't like the best thing to do. But at the same time, I'm not perfect. I've made mistakes in the past, too. And it was years ago. And I wouldn't want to be Thanks, judged. David. I wouldn't want to be judged so harshly on that one moment. Because I've had poor moments, too. That's not a poor moment. You pick in a fucking fight with a girl's boyfriend to he show how tough me- you are. Me and my ex broke up like a couple years ago. Yeah, okay, but I mean like you, 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 um, you picking a fight with a girl's boyfriend to show how tough you are? Like he wants some peach cobbler? <laughs> what if your boyfriend was a real fucking savage? I know, he was actually. I what was, if your boyfriend was like. In that moment, I actually got scared because I was like, oh no, like. Because my ex didn't take no shit, let me tell you. You know what I mean? And like, we live in a world like so where... So I was like, but I hope they don't ruin this girl's party. It wasn't even, you know, it was my friend's birthday party. Like someone like King Vaughn would have waited in the parking lot to kill him and he fucking walked out. You, you ever think, but like, dude, like you never know. <laughs> That's crazy. Like, I mean, he would. Over that, over a comment? For even less than that. That dude was a serial killer fucking practically. A serial killer? This, he's, he's, he's considered raps for serial killer. <laughs> King Vaughn? Yeah. No way. <laughs> yes. Okay, if you all... Who did he kill? Okay, all right. So hold on. So let me explain to the audience, okay? I just get hip to King Bond recently because I wasn't listening to like his music and shit like that. His music is really good, by the okay. way. Okay. I like his music. All right. We got one super chat really quick. Okay, Ryan. Ryan. Oh, dude. Also, y'all on these rookie numbers, 90 days, commit to that save yourself to a marriage bit. I'll watch all your relationships. <laughs> what are these going to be happy? Do it. Thanks, Ryan. Dude. I mean, God would be happy, though. Dude, that. that marriage thing, I've met girls who are doing that. Who are waiting for marriage? Yeah. What's wrong with waiting for marriage? In right? L.A. I met a girl who was doing that in L.A. She's celibate? I mean, she was trying to find a boyfriend, but every dude would, like, start out when they, when they hear that message. Because every dude is coming thinking, oh, I could get a change of mind. But she oh, was, you think so? She was committed to it, dude. Um, is she single now? No, I think she married some dude now. Some dude marry it. It worked. I, uh, are they still together is the question. I don't know if they are, actually. <laughs> but anyway, going back to the King Vaughn thing, right? Can you do, do th- can you talk, in, can I do this then? Like uh-huh. talk? No, you can't. Okay, here, you want to do it? Yeah. Okay, you cut the last piece. <laughs> okay, so King Vaughn, King Vaughn is a rapper out of Chicago, right? And, and you know, um, in Chicago, you have these different gangs, these different these different cliques, whatever have you. Anyway, mm-hmm. he, 
obviously grew up rough like a lot of rappers. But I mean, like, he really from he the streets. He grew up some, in Chicago. Some dudes sing about the streets, but other dudes... Chicago is the real right. streets. There's actually a three-hour documentary on YouTube dedicated to him Should called Raps for a Serial Killer. No, that's enough. And he's, um, he's linked to about a good... 10 murders. There's no way. Yeah, but the... the, the he was only like 25. He was 26 when he died because he got shot. Naturally, you're going to live long doing this shit. But the thing is, the thing, the thing is, um, the thing that makes it, that makes him interesting is that, um, he fit the classic definition of a serial killer in the sense that enjoy killing, oh. space in between killings, and then very targeted killings. Like he, but, in, but it wasn't serial as in just random people. It was like no, 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 no. But but, but serial killers, serial killers, serial killers don't do random. Serial killers have particular types. Like if you watch Silence of the Lambs, he had particular people they were going after. If you remember that movie, have you seen right? Mr. Brooks? Mm -mm. He was a serial killer. But in any like all serial killers, have, like Jeffrey Dahmer was guys. Oh, you know, okay. a gay, you know what I mean? Like they have a thing. So he was serial killing. Yeah, dude, this dude. His enemies. This dude. His, his type this was dude, his enemy. This dude was. This dude was fucking wild, man. I. So how did he not get put away? Because he got killed before. He's gonna end up in jail, but he okay. got killed before it happened. I didn't realize he killed some damn people. Dude, he been linked. And up. my little brother used to play video games and shit with him. He been linked to a bunch of fucking That's murders. That's scary. You know, he was the one rapper. Like when he was singing about it, he fucking really meant it. And then he'd be on Twitter. Well, he was he was going to jail anyway because the. The feds were on to him because whenever he do some shit, he killed someone and then jump on Twitter two seconds later. Heard someone died. Someone got shot. Shit like that. <laughs> yeah. But the murder's taking place in Chicago. It's so many. Every right. Day. And so the police don't give a fuck. Yeah. The police, the police don't care, you know? Like you have to really go above and beyond to get on their radar. I'm really curious to see what the hell this is about to turn into. This is about to turn into love, baby. Are you about to roll this up? Homeboy, oh you know that? You're so messy right now. What do you mean I'm so messy right now? You're getting it everywhere. I want it to be everywhere. I want it to be messy and greasy. Okay? This is what I want. All right? Alfredo weed. Yeah. This is what I want. Look at it. It's all on the table. Yeah, that part. If that were me, you'd be like, try to get it on the pasta, homeboy. That's different, homeboy. I'm the boss, okay? The boss is always an asshole. All right? Okay. Ready? <laughs> yeah, like everybody's <laughs> asking what's happening with the recipe. Like, what are you doing? Just relax, people. It's all good. This should work out, guys. This should work out, okay? Let me. They all did that in Chicago. <laughs> Say what? They all did that in Chicago? Yeah, but he was he was unique. Look him up. Look him up. And then go listen to his songs because he can tell the story of how he it happened. He tells the story. story. He's Fuck a storyteller. I'm saying his songs. He had this song about how he picked up this girl mm -hmm. and then ended up, I don't know, it was a good song. His stories weren't made up though. Don't eat the merchandise. I'm not eating the merchandise on board. smack your hands. Okay, look at this, right? I'm rolling. They see me rolling. They hating. Check it out, homeboy. Check it out. Check it out. Patrolling, trying to catch me riding dirty. Trying, trying to catch me riding dirty. dirty. Trying to catch me riding dirty. Okay, look at that. Look at that. I'm going to put that in here, okay? See here? I just put that in right in there, okay? So now you keep, you keep it going, all right? My music's so loud, they hate it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've never seen lasagna quite like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which tipsy bartender, homeboy? Can I help? Sure. What would you like to do? I would like to do one. Okay. Okay. Thank you. How's the chicken taste? Good, good. Don't overkill it with the chicken, though. Remember, you got to roll. Okay. So roll one at a time. The chicken tastes good because I seasoned it, y'all. It's, it's all right, I said. He said good. Y'all heard him say good? I said all right. <laughs> I didn't say fucking excellent, the best chicken I've ever had. Okay? All right? You got to give credit where it's due, Sky. All right. Keep it together, homeboy. Keep it together. <laughs> all right. Look at you. Yeah, you're getting some more chicken in there, okay? All right. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, dang. Were you drunk? No, I'm tripping over this thing that you didn't throw away. You want me to put, put, put this in the trash? Put it on the side. Put it on the side somewhere. Okay. So, guys, you see what's happening here. We roll this up like a marijuana joint, like it's 420, okay? Yeah, Dr. Strong was saying the pasta joint. The pasta joint. Okay. This is a 420 recipe. They look like lasagna roll-ups. They mm -hmm. are pretty much, right? Mm-hmm. 
Somebody said it's about cat meat. What the fuck? <laughs> it's chicken, homeboy. It's chicken. Okay, so we come. When in. I was in um, high school, mm -hmm. I was in AP biology, and we mm -hmm. dissected fucking cats, dude. What was that like? It's horrible. Probably there's a couple of serial killers in there too. I love cats. That sounds like a serial killer class. <laughs> Okay. Like big ass cats just fucking cutting them open and shit. Where did we even get the budget to do that? I went to a public school. What, to cut up cats? Yeah. There's a bunch of strays in the neighborhood. Where, where are you from? Milwaukee. Okay, all them strays running around with Milwaukee. That's you what he came from. You can't just go from. around killing cats, dude. What do you mean? You can't just go around killing cats. All serial killers start off killing cats. That's how it works. Mm. Cat is the first thing you kill. Oh, yeah. Okay. Come on now, come on. Ooh, yeah. What's that? Hmm? <laughs> Somebody says Shayla in a blanket. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's what this is? The Shayla in the blanket? <laughs> what? Okay. So Y'all did big frogs. We did cats and we did pigs. Pigs? That's and we did close to a human. Um, eels. Eels. Well, uh, yeah. In Germany, we didn't have to do that. You didn't dissect anything? No. We were supposed to dissect it, open it up, and then label all of its guts, like what organs was each. I mm -hmm. failed, I damn near failed that class. You did? AP Biology? I didn't even bother taking the AP test to get college credits because I knew I was gonna fail that bitch. These last ones are rolled really Because you did them, Sky. Hor horribly, let's do one more. Okay? Mm-hmm. What? You gotta tuck and roll. You gotta tuck it when you roll it. Yeah, hit me, hit, hit me, hit me with um, put some cheese on here too. Let's drop some cheese on this one. Oh yeah. Here we go. Drop the rest of it. Okay. Sky, do you want me to roll it? I think you're struggling. Sky. I look like I fucking struggle. Yes, with you. you look like you're struggling. Why? Why would I be struggling? No, tell me why. Tell me why. You mean because because it's so slippery? It is slippery. Mm hmm. Why would I be struggling, Shayla Sheree? Because you just did these last three that are struggled. You did. You did one of them. I too. did this one, right here. No, the most I did perfect that. one. Whatever. They're all good. Okay. <laughs> they all will work out. Are you gonna pour the Alfredo on top too? In a second. Oh, and the cheese. This is gonna be good. Yeah. Well, you have to put some cheese throughout it first. All right. So this is a real ass meal, y'all. Y'all can make this for y'all kids. <laughs> for y'all kids. <laughs> <laughs> for y'all friends when they come over. Okay, so pour some Alfredo sauce on this now. Did you preheat the oven? No. Turn it on. <laughs> oh my goodness. It don't take long, man. So what? Go oh, like 350. Everything in here ready cooked. Everything in here ready cooked, so we should be good. All right, guys. All right. Beautiful. Okay, now let's come behind it with some cheese. You could drop bits of cream cheese on that if you want to as well. Uh-uh. Why? I think it's good. Why not? I think it's perfect how it is. Just little chunks. Let me show you. Okay. I'm going to show you a hater. <laughs> Stephanie said she'd eat this. Yeah, Stephanie is a good little treat, you know? Antonio says, I got 20 kids and I'm 28. Damn, Antonio. Do you though? Do you really have 20 kids? Or are you just making that up? That's a lot of kids. I hope you take care of them all. You can't take care of 20 kids, homeboy. I mean, Nick Cannon can take care of all his kids. Nick Cannon rich. <laughs> How do you know this dude is? Are you rich? Are you rich, Antonio? With your 20 kids? Rich people don't have How 20. many different baby mamas you got? That's the real question. Elon is the only dude, only rich dude I know who have a bunch of kids out there. Who? With 95 baby mamas. Elon? E Elon Musk, yeah. No way, really? Most of them don't do that. I didn't know that he had that many. I didn't even know he had kids. Elon Musk? 
I didn't know he had kids. He got about 13 kids or some shit like that. Really? He got about 13 kids between like five, six different baby Damn, mamas. why couldn't I win the fucking lottery and just be somebody's kid like Elon Musk or something? <laughs> he likes smart girls though. You gotta, you gotta be... No, I'm saying why couldn't I be his kid? Why couldn't oh, I be born into the family? His kids don't like him though. <laughs> you saying I'm not smart? I mean, not as smart as his girls would be. Yeah, that's true. His, he, um... He like, he like girls with like really high IQs. That doesn't make them necessarily street smart, but he likes girls with high IQs because he's trying to breed like intelligent, really smart people. That makes sense. However, all the kids hate him. The trans one hates him for sure. There's a trans one already? Yeah. How old is it? <laughs> I don't know, like teenage. Teenage, you know. How old is Elon Musk? 50 something. Early 50s. This is, um... Mozzarella cheese. Uh huh. You got eight baby mamas. You have eight baby mamas, yeah. And twenty kids. Mm mm. Like thirteen. No, I'm talking about yeah, Antonio. Antonio. Antonio has eight baby mamas. Oh, he had eight baby mamas. Good for you, homeboy. Oh, lady said, have y'all ever ate pig feet? No. Yeah, I have. <laughs> but I saw this hilarious video last night of this mom trying to give her son chicken feet and he literally started hyperventilating. How old was he? How old was he? <laughs> Te like a little kid? Yes. She brought, first of all, she said, are you hungry? He said, not really. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you know he don't like her cooking. <laughs> and then she set the plate down. He said, oh shoot. <laughs> <laughs> She said, you better eat that. He said, <laughs> but I didn't ask for this. <laughs> I was on my phone dying, <laughs> dying last night. If y'all have me on Instagram, look at my uh, story because I posted it. It's hilarious. Are you going to wear that dress for my boy tonight? What dress are you talking about? The one with all your niblets and shit hanging out? No. <laughs> That's gonna, I'm going to wear that for a photo shoot. Okay. All right. Okay. Guys, we just wait on the oven to heat up a little bit, and then we will be good to go. And this is only gonna take a few minutes, you know what I mean? So this quick. Okay, let's hit them with another drink. Drink time, homeboy. Drink time. Okay. What do you suggest, Shayla? Let's do. Let's do what? What y'all got? Let's do something with that watermelon juice. Did you pour it out already? What watermelon juice? I drank it. Oh. I only had a little bit of that. What are you talking about? The watermelon juice. Let's do something with that watermelon juice. Is that what he said? What? I, I'm talking to La Soul. What? The little kid. He said, that, that looked like dinosaur feet. <laughs> I, I knew it. But it was chicken feet and it still had the, like, the nails and stuff on was it. Was the mom messing with him? I don't know. But you could tell she does that a lot because the way he got so stressed out. Like she just messed with him all the time. Probably. Because she said, are you hungry? He said, not really. What kid says not really? Kids be hungry all the time. Not really. Not all. Not all. Shit. Some kids don't like fucking eating. I was they... always fucking hungry. Yeah, me too. But I mean, like, <laughs> but I had a lot of friends who just wanted to play. You know, they don't have time to eat. They, they ain't into eating shit. Like their parents have to be like, hey, you have to eat. There's some kids like, there's a lot of kids like that. Jack Daniels black with a jalapeno back. What? Jack Daniels black with a... I don't have Jack Daniels black. Oh, somebody says, I see that rum chata in the back. Let's do the rum. Somebody said uh, something with rum chata and peach or something like that. Okay, but what was, what was it? Peach uh, crown. And it's supposed to taste like a peach cobbler, right? Yep. Rum chata and peach crown. Supposedly. Nice. Just those two. Y'all sure? I mean. Thank you, Strawn. Aw, thanks. What are you saying? Strawn likes my nails. Sean, stop lying. They're pretty man. old, but thank you. I think they still look good. Strawn, could you come yeah. up with better lies than this, man? Come on, man. Stop. That girl's nails look like someone's foot. It look like a little chicken feet. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I tell you what. So let's let's do this then. Let's put this on the side. So let's let's grab grab a mixing glass. Okay. This for when it comes out, guys. That's just some 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 um, green onions I um sliced up. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're doing a shot. What, what's this shot called? Who gave you this idea? Peach cobbler. Somebody in the chat said something about Yeah, I about forgot it. who that was, but somebody... Peach cobbler? Little cobbler boys these cobbler. days are always hungry. That's what I'm saying. He okay. said, not really. 
He knew his mom was gonna stress him out. Are you all Zendaya fans? Anyone in here is a I Zend love her. She's so cute. She was she was, she did an interview because she got a new movie coming out, right? So she's doing interviews and she's talking about what it's like being the breadwinner in the family okay. as a kid. Because oh, remember, yeah. all, her and all these dudes started as child actors, mm -hmm. right? And so what's that like on day one? Oh, he got a picture of her. What's that like on day one, freaking like being being a child, like being a child probably actor? Really, probably so much pressure on you. Yeah, but you you feeding the whole family, mom and dad yeah, and brothers okay. and sisters and shit, dude. That is fucking wild. It must be stressful. But see, the problem with that is as they get a little bit older, sometimes depending on who's in the kids' air, when they turn like sixteen, then they get emancipated. You know, you ever heard you heard of that, I right? Heard about that. Yeah. When, when my question is, when you have a when you have a kid and you're so used to the kid providing for the family. Once that kid turns 18 and, and all that money is theirs, what do you do? Like, do you just run out of money? Do you have to go get a job now? Like, Well, you have to get the kid to understand that you made the sacrifices for this kid. Because remember now, she's a child actor. I mean, her mom or dad have to be on set. They mm -hmm. have to take her auditions. They have to work on her age, all that sort of shit. So they did the first 18. So you expect it to kind of contribute, you know, because you wouldn't be where you are without them. Understand that she would not be here today. Without her parents. So she just be so starting. So now she has to pay her parents' bills for the rest of her You don't have life. to pay your parents' bills for the rest of your life, but I mean, you fucking owe them. You know what I mean? You owe them, in my opinion. Okay, let's grab a block of ice. I, I, think, I think you owe them, right? Guys, you don't think you owe them? I don't know, Sky. Par they, d they decided to have that child, you know? Hmm? It's a parent's job to take care of their kids. They're, yeah, but they took you to every audition. And, and then she started winning bread for them and taking care of the family. So now I don't owe you shit. I took care of you for the past, since I was 12 years old. Y'all gotta figure it out now. I don't think that's the way to go. They, they sacrificed for you. What is your opinion on this? Guys, what do you think, you know? I think, I think they sacrificed for you. You have to return that favor. A mind. parent's job is to sacrifice for their child. Every parent has to sacrifice for their child. But if your parents did not bend over backwards, she would not be making fucking multi-million dollar movies. How do you movies. know they bent over backwards? Because, dude, to get there in Hollywood, you have to bend over backwards. They have to take you to auditions. They have to find the right agent. They have to push you for the right parts. They have to turn down the right stuff and take the right stuff. You understand? Because just getting cast in a movie does not mean that that's a good thing. What if the movie's complete shit? Okay? okay. So check this out. Suppose you have two movies on the table. You got freaking... I don't know, Titanic. Okay, tell you what else came out the same time as Titanic. I think it was Deuces Wild was a movie that came out around the same time as Titanic, right? No one even know what the fuck that is. I only know about that because I remember meeting a guy who was in it, right? Mm -hmm. and, okay, so your parents sitting there and they're looking at two scripts, Titanic or Deuces Wild. And, and both directors want your child. They have to pick the right fucking one. You see what I'm saying? So there's a lot of goals into that. So I feel you owe them. But hey, they're your parents. If you want to kick them out, then that's your <laughs> business, okay? She knows what she's getting to already. No matter what she says, she's grown. Yeah. All right. Ready, Shayla? Yeah. So let us start off with some crown peach. Do like, do like a half ounce of that. We ain't gonna make big shots. So one, two, a little bit more than that. A little bit more than that. A little bit more than that. Okay. Match it. Okay. That's the oven going off. That ain't a match. I thought it was a match. No, oh, dude. That's a little bit. Next time, let's just do this, okay? Let's just do this so we know, all right? Okay, you said not <laughs> too much. Put this in the oven, guys. Put it in the oven. He said not too much. You want me to Welcome shake to it? Welcome to the club, A.V. Yes. Shake it and keep it sexy. LaSalle said, I would want to take care of my parents if they did that for me. Okay, that's Yeah, me sense. too. Me too. I'd buy my mama a house. Fuck yeah, but a house ain't enough. A house is not enough. I'm, and get, let me, okay, let me tell you all this. But, if, but just because my, okay, here's my argument. Just because your parents were, were pushing your, your child's career does not mean they were good to you. I'll tell you that much. No, very true, very because true. Because Bella, who was that, who was, who was happy that her mom died? Bella Thorne? No, 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 the other one. Bella. Sam from um, iCarly. Oh. Her mom abused the fuck out of her, okay? So... You know, it, to each their own. Shake it, did it? Did she? What yeah, a mom did talk. Super yeah. chats. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Some parents. Pretty. They, uh, some parents are lazy. Well, not lazy, but some parents they don't they want their kid to be the breadwinner, so they don't have to worry about it. And that that was her mom, though. That was her mom. In, in certain cases. In Hollywood, though, I mean, so much is required of child actors that I, it may not be tough 
for a parent just to like, you know, just put them there and not do a whole lot. Oh yeah, baby. Nice. What is this called though? Peach cobbler. Peach cobbler. Shot? Peach cobbler. Okay, go ahead, Sheila. Try that. Zendaya. So guys, this is equal parts. Crown peach and rum chata. Those of you just joined us. Go ahead. Somebody said, damn, she got money like that. Zendaya is definitely rich. Hold on, let's see what she's worth. She in every fucking eye. She's so rich. I can only imagine how rich she is. I don't think she had 100 million yet, though. I think she more like 20, 30, somewhere around. Let's see. Ooh. Zendaya net worth. It's like a it's like a spicy peach cobbler. There's some spice in there. Okay, someone have 22 million. Yeah, they have a That's good, y'all. Yeah, there's, there's about 20, someone says she's around 22 million. How much is her husband worth? Who, Tom Holland? Yeah. Oh, probably more than her though. You think so? Fuck yeah, or oh, 25, 25. Oh, okay, they're around the same. No, but he's Spider-Man and that just seemed to have so much more legs than fucking. Than what yeah. she's done? Yeah. That some she's been in the game for much longer. Can you look at your mic No, he's a child actor too. Is he a child actor as well? Dude, they all child actors. Hmm. Yeah. I think much. they're the cutest couple, by the way. Yeah. I love them together. Well, okay, so she's doing this movie where um, she's some tennis star who got, gets hurt, and then her boyfriend and her, and her, the dude she's training, there's this love triangle, you know what I mean? So I think it have a lot of sex scenes with both of them, okay? Or like a threesome or some shit. So I know they had an intimacy coordinator. Guys, y'all, I don't know if y'all know, some of you might not know, an intimacy co coordinator is one that hires, comes on set and makes the kissing and the sex look real and natural and passionate and stuff like that, right? Because, okay, like, Shale and I don't really like each other. So if we did a movie right now and a sex scene, it can be all awkward because you know I can be going for a kiss like, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, and the sex can be more like, okay? <laughs> and then, then the sex one, then it comes, guy, you can't snarl, okay? I know you don't want to fucking do this. You have to act like you enjoy the shit, all right? No way. Yeah, because... The I didn't know they had those. I just thought that people were good actors. Because uh, 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 this shit got to be right. I wonder if, like, anybody's ever had to, like... If, if Let's say, like, you, your love interest, like, has really bad hygiene. Yeah, all that shit or, comes like, into play. Or, like, stank breath or all something. That shit, all that shit matters. That's where the inti intimacy coordinator comes in, because that's someone you could talk to about that. And you'd be like, his breath even, fucking stinks. Make okay. him brush his teeth before the scene. Even in porn... The shit has to be, you might not necessarily have an intimacy coordinator, but you have people on set, like the director and stuff like that. I mean, because these are all dudes who work in porn, they can tell you stuff. Because, okay, imagine if you're doing something like this with someone, right? The camera can't see what's going on. So now that you know that, I want you to watch. If a guy's doing something like that, he's going to have a foot behind the other foot to keep it open so that you could see... I don't motion. really watch porn like that. I don't watch it like that either, but I read a book. Okay? <laughs> and so you could see what's happening because mm -hmm. in a normal scenario, when you're at home with someone doing your thing, everything you do is blocked from view because your parts are touching this other person's parts and all that's blocked out. Mm -hmm. So, but when you watch porn, you notice you could see it because they have to fucking like angle and shit to get shit Sky, right. Sky, do you have a secret porn career we don't know about? No, let me tell you. So back in the old days, before Tipsy Bartender, I used to do Sky John. I used to interview people who had like, you know, crazy jobs. So I was okay. actually on a porn set to do an interview with a porn star. And you saw it? While they were shooting, yes. So listen, I'm here. Me and, me, me and the person that I go with, we're here. And they're right there doing a freaking scene. Waiting on me to finish so you they could. turned on? Dude, it's so fucking, it's, I mean, I can be honest. Seeing it is not a sexy thing because okay. it's so... It's so, it's so crazy. And the thing is, as the camera pans away from their faces to their bodies, they're talking to each other like, you know, do this, go left, go right, okay, do that. Okay, like they're signaling to each other of like what to do next. And while she's doing, while she's talking to them, she's going, oh baby, oh how baby. You can still be in the moment. There, like. there's, there is no moment. That's why they required so much skill, you see? So and the it, porn stars are skillful people. Oh, they got skill. Fuck yeah, especially old porn stars. Because you gotta understand, every guy today could be a porn star because of Viagra, okay? Because that's a revolutionary pill that changed the fucking game. In the old days, you just have to keep and, and old days, one of the most talked about porn stars was this, was this dude named Ron Jeremy. He got in trouble towards the end for some sexual assault and shit like that. And I think he's, he died now, right, Ron Jeremy? 
Yeah. I think he had Alzheimer's at the end and all that was in jail. And I think he died in jail recently. That's sad. He might be dead. I don't know. But the thing is, he did a scene with 20 women in a circle, right? And this like 30 fucking years ago or some shit. This, way, this predates Viagra. So for you to maintain, you know, that level of, for you he to. He had a lot of stamina. Right. For you to have the stamina to do that with no breaks, okay, is insane. So the reason I know that. So the girls were just waiting for their turn. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. But see, the reason I know that is because one of my boys that, I, again, this is a dude I interviewed who's a porn star, right? And I was asking him, like, who does he look to, up to in the industry? Like, who does he think is one of the baddest ever? He's like, Sky. Ron Jeremy did this scene. And then he described to me why it was so difficult. Because if you look at it as a civilian, mm -hmm. you don't fucking know. But when you hear porn dudes talk about it and he go like, Sky, to go around that circle and do all this each fucking time mm -hmm. with no Viagra, he's like, dude, that shit's fucking incredible. You know? This conversation just went into a weird place. <laughs> 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 Somebody says, Sky, you high right now? Or you said you're going high now? This is, yeah, this conversation just went to a, a, a really, a really unusual place. Let me check this. <laughs> Let me check this thing in the oven. <laughs> Seems like Antonia with the 20 kids and the eight baby mamas might be able to, might be able to match that. <laughs> That's wild, though. I couldn't even, I wouldn't even want, huh? I wouldn't even want to be in that situation. In what situation? Like, where I'm, I'm expected to, like, 20 different people, like, expected to perform to that kind of level. Yeah, but that's, but that's the thing. That, and see, the crazy thing with, with this, the, this is the profession where women make more than the men. He didn't make more money? I mean, he was a big star, Probably. so maybe. But women in porn make more than men in porn do. Although the men have to have the stamina to do the fucking scene. That's crazy. It's Hi, crazy. David Fuentes. But that's honestly probably the only industry where women make more than the men. That's one of them, yeah. That's yeah. one of them. And then, and then guys make more money if they go to the other side. If they, Saint said this episode was a fever dream. <laughs> <laughs> and guys make more money if they start doing like trans and gay stuff. Oh. So, oh, so you that see. Makes so you see some of the big boys would switch over and start doing like trans stuff and you'd be like, why is he doing that? Because the pay is more. When I went on that HBO show, there was a guy who they put on the show who's a porn, or he's an OnlyFans dude. And he, ha and he like caters to gay people, but he claims that he's not gay. What is caters to gay people though? His OnlyFans is, it's, it's a lot of gay shit on there. Like is he doing stuff to himself? I didn't, I haven't looked, but my friend who was in town recently that uh -huh. does Flo Millie's makeup, he was like, oh, you know Dallas, his name is Dallas. He's like, oh, you know Dallas? And I was like, well, I did a TV show with him. And he was like, dude, that dude is definitely a gay porn star. And I was like, no way. Because on the show, he refused to do anything gay. But then he why showed would he me do, some videos why would of he do, him. Why would he do gay stuff on the, on the show? Him, because it was a show where you're dating couples. Okay, so but he was dating a couple, and there was a man and a woman in the couple, and he refused to do anything with the man because he said he wasn't gay. Okay, hold then on. you go on his OnlyFans account, and there's a bunch of gay stuff up there. Okay, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, wait a minute now. If I do something with a couple, I have to touch the dude? If you're dating the couple, you're dating both of them, not just one of them. No, dude, I dating your fucking wife. I ain't dating you. <laughs> I mean, that's how it works for him, I guess. But. What? Yeah, gay for pay. Gay for pay. Hold on, so gay hold on. Pay. So when you when you in this when you so when you in this couple thing, you have to touch the dude? I don't know. I mean I wasn't in there. Jesus. I I don't know. Christ, I wasn't that's, there for their this situation. shit's wild. Let me check this food. Oh boy, this, <laughs> this gay is, for pay shit. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. That makes so he was only gay for pay. This is this not is, in real life. This is wild homeboy. What's going he on? He was there? like one of the top social uh top OnlyFans dudes though. Like he makes a lot of money. Really? Mm-hmm. Really? A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money. Yeah. Does he? Yeah. Well, that's what I heard. So. Hey, David from Chicago, by the way. Hey, way up, dude. That's fucking crazy, Sheila. <laughs> Ryan says, I have relationships with women and sex with men. Law and order theme into the <laughs> So he has what relationships? <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's, um, that's a little wild. I never thought about that, that you have to touch the guy. Wow. I mean, it was a... It was okay, so all these couples, the guys were touching the guys? So there was a lesbian couple who was dating a dude. There was a straight couple who I dated. 
And then there was another straight couple that he dated. Okay, so and the, it was a, the show was going to be called Thrupple. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. A lesbian couple dating to do it. Yeah, well, they were, they weren't lesbian, but they were together for ten years. The two girls. That's fucking lesbian. I mean, they, you know, so they were dating a dude. They wanted to put introduce some peen peen in their in their life. So this dude smashed both of them. No, this was the different dude. The dude that I'm talking. No, no, about. I know, I know, but the dude with the lesbian couple. So he was only attracted to one of them. Oh shit. <laughs> Okay, what kind of lesbian? Like, like the real butch kind? It was a cute girl, and then it was a thicker, more chubbier girl, and they were neither of them were bush, but butch. he was more attracted to one of them than the other, and so their relationship didn't work out because he only wanted to be one of them. Oh shit! So he did hit it though. I think so. Ooh, both of them? I don't know, Sky. Like I said, I was not there. Dude, you can imagine so. being with a woman who ain't been with a man in two hundred years or ever. 10 years, it was like a good 10 years. Jesus Christ, okay. What do you think? What do you think? Do you think, what, what makes it crazy? Dude, that's just gonna be some weird shit. <laughs> cause I feel the minute, okay, cause okay, you know like, all right, the girl's lesbian and then she's doing this show and yeah, I could totally do it. And then the minute she actually feels what that is, she's like, fuck. You act like strap-ons don't exist. Yeah, but that's a strap on by a woman. That's not a dude with the weight following and all. I mean, ooh. we gotta change the subject. It's getting too spicy. Too I'm spicy. just, I'm just saying that's some wild shit, homeboy. Who looks like your math teacher? He does. <laughs> that is, that is, that is wild. What's, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Um, CCP. Hey, that is. The Lord said rubber. I barely even know her. Yeah, dude, that is, that is some. Fucking wild It was shit. a wild, fun experience, and it never made it to TV. Thank God. So. It might come to TV? It's not going to come. They Why? Know. They It got shelved if so one of, long ago. If one of you was suddenly to become famous in some other area, that fucking shit's airy. Mm. I can tell you right now. Okay. It's been so long already. Uh, There's only been a couple years. Yeah. Like a year or two. It's been like two, at least two years. Dude, you, could, you don't have to shell that. You could still put that out, okay? But, they, they're, but nobody's famous. Eh, I'm just saying if, you know. Even five years from now, they would still air it. it. At that point, it's been like seven years. I mean, shit could still happen, though. Shit could still happen. I'm looking, I'm looking, guys. Checking the food coming in there right now. Okay. Hi, Bachi. Hi, Isaiah. Uh, Isaiah said the lesbian couple is an absolute yes. <laughs> Yeah, today I agree. Today's episode is definitely a fever dream. A little, 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 little bit longer, a little bit longer. A fever Two minutes. dream. Good night, Ryan. Yeah, I mean, look, look. I'm, I'm just saying that that's a whew, I don't know. This, this is, this is an interesting one. Yeah. But dude, it, it would because it could still come back. Just trust me. You know. We'll see. Because HBO owns that, and if they want to use it, they fucking can. They Sky, can. give us some rose before spent, she They leave. spent millions of dollars filming the shit, so. Probably not millions. It's a reality show, so it's not they spent, millions. They, they spent a, lot, a good chunk of money. You, th you think so? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Well, well, who knows? Who knows? By the way, guys, Margot Robbie. We're all my Margot Robbie fans, okay? I love her. So after she did Barbie, okay, Barbie was a huge success, you know? Okay. Guess what she's going to do next? Ken? Monopoly, okay? She's doing a Monopoly movie, homeboy. Hmm. Stephen Quick with the photo, Monopoly movie. That's really interesting, though. How are they going to turn Monopoly into a movie? I don't know. This is going to be real life. So it's someone's, like someone's going to be that dude there in the front with the money, okay? Okay. Someone's going to be the jailer. I mean, I don't know. I don't know how they can do it. But I mean, since Barbie did so well, they figure like, shit, let's just stick with let's toys. Try. You know, let's just stick with the toys, <laughs> own boy. <laughs> I mean, the Barbie movie was phenomenal in my opinion yeah you know let's just did you did you watch it i watch pieces of it i never watch the whole thing i gotta okay. i gotta get it because a I lot know. of dudes got offended but i thought it was funny no i didn't get a sky so sky that glows you can have forever for free what, what? <laughs> the fuck is the language is this facebook it's a bot it's a bot <laughs> no it's not a bot this show should be called 50 shades of rome the tipsy bartender version Fifty Shades of This Rome. episode, yeah. Yeah, yeah, listen, listen, listen. Um, I can't wait to see the Barbie movie. Um. <laughs> the Monopoly movie? By the way, y'all been watching Shogun? No? I watched one episode. Is it good? He recommended I watch it, actually. Me? No, my crush. Oh, their crush, that, the red flag, that do it? Now, when you tell him this, watch this dude not attack me. Firstly, he's not even going to want you to do this show, okay? Stop 
saying that. Oh, I Come know on, motherfuckers. Relax. I know dudes. Okay. okay. Relax. Don't act like you ain't never had no red flag about you. And, and don't act like y'all in the chat ain't never had a red flag. Because none of us are perfect, okay? So I'll start there. And he's not the controlling type. Sound like it. He's that, gonna looks, have, that looks really good. He's going to have a peach cobbler, huh? That sound like it. This looks really good. Okay, guys. Been better if I let that brown more, but hey, it is what it is. Malia, don't tell me too much, though, because I've only seen the first episode. And you liked it? Yeah, it was really, really good. Yeah, I heard Shogun's supposed to be fucking the it's shit. It's really dude. good. Okay, guys. Yeah. So I got some little green peppers on there. Chili, ready to try this shit? Yes. Did you taste this? I did, and I poured the rest in there so they know that we made one. Okay, okay. Good. It's good. It, it's, it's like a, a spicy peach cobbler. So you like it? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's called a peach cobbler. Damn. You want to dry this on a dry towel? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's good. I, I can already tell it's going to be good. Ladies and gentlemen, let me put this back. Let me guess. You want to do the serving it? Go ahead. You serve. can serve. Why you want me to serve? Because huh? you're going to complain about how I do it. I'm not going to complain. Yes, you are. I'm not going to complain, homeboy. All right. Look at this cheese pool, Stefan. You ready? No! Nice. <laughs> 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 okay, we got meat falling everywhere. Let me get this one over here. Meat and cheese. Oh shit, I'm breaking it up. So AV says, Shayla says, Sky your location in case you get kidnapped. <laughs> LOL. I ain't coming to say it both from that crazy dude. Actually, I don't know if he's crazy. You better not mention this, this shit to this dude, because they could already see this dude coming, like, coming mention back. What? Mention what are you talking about? Mention what? I was talking shit about him. Why would I say anything? I don't know. He might be watching anyway. He's not watching. Okay, ready? Yes. Which one do you want? Yeah, take the cute one. The cute one. Yeah, oh, shit. <laughs> and there you have it, homeboy. This is the, ah, uh, Jesus. The what is this, like the, the chicken? No, this is an Alfredo, this is an Alfredo roll-up lasagna, or Alfredo lasagna roll-up. The chicken Alfredo lasagna roll-up. Okay? It's not, gonna, it's not gonna taste bad. It can't taste bad. I'm sure it's not gonna taste bad. You know? It's, it's, not, it's not gonna be bad. This one works, all right? <laughs> How was it? Mm -hmm. Tipsy gourmet. Crispy bartender, yes, <laughs> CCP. It's the best. What do you think, Sheila? Mm. You like it? I'm trying not to eat pasta these days, but this is delicious. Yeah, me too, me too, me too. I try not to eat shit these days. You're doing really days. well, people. Yeah, this is so good, y'all. Okay. Homeboy. Oh no, this is real tasty. So what do we have? We have five drinks today. How many drinks we did? Guys, check this out. We started our day off with this mini watermelon punch in a bowl. Y'all got to check that out. Then we came over here with this uh, tequila sunrise mimosa. Okay. Then we followed that up with this pink lemonade margarita named after Lexi. Then we came behind that with a peach water moccasin. Okay. And then we follow that up with a peach cobbler, which is equal parts peach whiskey and rum chata. Mm -hmm. Super simple recipe, but it's good to go, okay? What, hey, how do you think that'll feel if we hit that with a little cinnamon? Oh, let me see. It's already cin cinnamony. That's is what it? I'm saying. That's why I said spicy. It, it's very cinnamony already. It, like, it feels like there's fireball in there or something. Okay, but I just want to hit it with a touch of cinnamon. Just a little pinch, and then give you a little taste, and you tell me what you think, okay, guys? So you see here? All right. Now here, taste that and tell me what you think. It's really spicy now, though. Oh, it's too much? Okay. But the first initial, like, flavor is really good. Before, before the cinnamon? Mm-hmm. Okay. So leave the cinnamon out. Um, maybe just use less, um, less of this and more of this. Like, not equal parts. Mm-hmm. And then the cinnamon will go good, yeah. 
If you do equal parts, what? No cinnamon. Okay. But if you use less Crown Royal and more rum chata, then you can add cinnamon. Oh, I see. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Because the, the, the peach Crown Royal is already spicy. Mm -hmm. So what do you think about this dish? This is fire. All right, and it wasn't that hard, huh? Mm -mm. Okay. This is good. Okay. <laughs> anyway, look here, ladies and gentlemen. Our main stream is YouTube. Please like this video. Okay, please come over to YouTube and become a member, okay? Support the show. Help us to help you by helping us buy some alcohol. Damn, I'm choking. Okay? We need money for booze. That's how my boy gonna, that's, that's the sound my boy gonna be making tonight. Anyway, you alright? <laughs> <laughs> Don't be a dad watching this. <laughs> this guy, give us some rubbers before she leaves so she that. can give it to him. Shut up. Keep it safe. She don't believe in condoms, guys. She's one of them Christians who believe that, you know, it should be natural, okay? And that's how you catch chlamydia, okay? Anyway, look here. <laughs> look here, guys. Thanks for watching us. Thanks for hanging out. Let's be here tomorrow, same time, you know, 5.30 p.m., Eastern Standard Time, 2.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, okay? Wrap it up, Shayla. Wrap that shit up, okay? No raw dog tonight, homeboy. I don't want you, want you on the set all toxic, okay? Okay? With all kind of rash and shit, scratching, all right? <laughs> I can already, Manny, why shouldn't I eat too much? I can already see her tomorrow. That sky, hey, 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 hey. I'm like, good damn, Shayla, you want crack? Wait a minute. It's not crack. Shut That's crabs. Up, first of all, this girl got crabs, okay? <laughs> I cannot do that. And then you come in my house and the crabs jump on me. You know what I mean? That's how it is, homeboy. That's how people get contaminated. Lord okay? Tachonka says my mom is watching right now. <laughs> she could be. You know? That's how, let me tell you, that's how these diseases are transferred. You go on a date, do some are weird shit. Are you speaking shit. from experience? No, I'm just, I'm near you every day, and this is what I'm trying to avoid. I don't want to be standing here scratching, you know? What happened? You know, did I, didn't I shower? And then I realized, holy shit, Sky, you got crabs, you know? The Is that how crabs work? The 2024 version, new and improved, okay? Okay. Come on now, old crabs was old and lean and frail. These crabs not lifting weights, you know? They drinking <laughs> prime. <laughs> they doing sit-ups and shit. They drinking Celsius. <laughs> yeah, these fuckers ready, they can fight, okay? <laughs> anyway, look here, look here. <laughs> You all drink responsibly. Don't, Don't drink and dry. Stay tipsy. Oh, tomorrow we can know if my boy smashed. So be here, okay, to hear the news. We start now with the conversation. How the fuck did this date go? Okay, watch the red flags, right? <laughs> <laughs> Adios, mi gente. Nos vemos. <laughs>